ladies and gentlemen, welcome. Hey, it is a glorious Friday, and that's all Friday should be, really. And we are about to play some video games. This should work. <laughs> this absolutely should work. If it doesn't, well, la-dee-da. And who is this person all of a sudden randomly immediately commenting on my profile? Sorry, on my... Huh, all right. I'm not sure who that is. I'm assuming it's a Twitter bot immediately answering to my tweet about the stream which one of the which one of the words I wonder triggered them because the message on Twitter that I sent was we're going to 1999 with a new channel feature uh, oh god I also made a mistake in the text but okay too late to change that a new channel feature called classic jams uh, where I'll be playing games from my childhood that I still love it's true. Still love, at least, uh, Jagged Alliance 2. First up on the list, Jagged Alliance 2, augmented with the version 1.13 patch, uh, and subscribers get characters named after them. And what I assume is a bot, because this person is not following me, and nobody that I know is following them, and tweet has not been retweeted. They immediately answered with, just hit me up. And all they are posting are some quotes inspirational quotes that's all they're doing all through the day and they also posted a some sort of a influencer network something something whatever that might be uh and the name for that is and the name for that influencer network is king's ransoms which honestly i don't feel like it's a good name for any kind of network <laughs> Like, well, I mean, kings, okay, maybe. Ransoms? Slightly iffy. <laughs> well, anyway. Uh, that is just the preamble, I suppose. The real amble is about to come. Um, I'm going to be doing a little bit of interesting stuff over here. Uh, uh, um, based on the fact that this is an old game. Uh, we'll have some uh, tricks that we'll have to do to get this game on screens. Also, uh, we'll perhaps play with the volume just a little bit. But other than that, this should be a pretty playable experience. And we'll see what happens. Uh, first 30 minutes or so, perhaps, won't be even spent playing. We'll be doing, uh, we'll be doing a little bit of a, a little bit of like a. Um, uh, preparation uh, in game still, but it's preparation nonetheless. There's one thing that I really wanted to look up, and that is uh, Jagged Alliance to uh, intro uh, intro movie. Is this this one? Yeah, I think it is. So uh, unfortunately, due to technical limitations, we I am unable to show you that movie in game. If I try to do that, the game crashes basically hang on the black screen and nothing shows up but i think i can i can manage to get that on your screens and let's see if this works let's turn off the music uh ooh, okay and let's get it going i think this should be okay this intro is with everything including Oh, it's also very crackly. No, that is that is the the uh, this is from uh, from official channel GOG.com. So, anyway, we are going to Arulco, a nondescript third world country somewhere in nondescriptia. Also, check out the fantastic 3D graphics. That is once again 1999. And yeah, this is only the intro. Uh, as the story ha uh, as the story goes, a leader of this country. Uh, maybe we'll see that still. Well, actually, let's just watch it, and if anything, anything gets explained in this one, great. If if it doesn't, I'm gonna explain it. To you. But yeah, war, a civil war, pretty much. It's been ages since I've seen this one. I think I've only like seen it once. And obviously, then every single time I would just skip it. And if I'm not mistaken, this one plays every single uh, every single day. Also, now, <laughs> many years later, uh, I I noticed that this the prologue of this game takes place in Prague, Czech Republic. <laughs> Who would have thunk it? 
Uh, when I was younger, that really didn't mean that much to me. Nowadays, a little bit more. So yeah, in Czech Republic, we are meeting with the uh, uh, Arulko's previous leader, previous uh, president, I think his title was. Uh, we're obviously sitting in the uh, pr prime Czech or Prague uh, uh, coffee shop, Petrinska Kaverna. I was Petrinska happy to hear you have decided to take the assignment. No doubt your inquiries have shown that I, Enrico Chivaldori, speak the truth. In the past ten years, since so, killing my father Enrico and Chivaldori. me, my wife uh, has inflicted us, great suffering upon my people. Those that may be of value to her are imprisoned, beaten, and tortured. The old, the sick, even infants with birth defects are removed swiftly from the population. Okay, I don't remember that either. About now the infants with birth defects. Remove her. I have brought the money you requested. It is everything I have. However, Arulko is full of gold and silver, and you might be able to convince the miners to help us in the struggle. There also exists a small but determined rebel movement. They are led by a man named Miguel Cordona. If you can locate Miguel, I have written a letter for you to give him. I believe he will accept you and prove to be an invaluable ally. I wish you luck, my friend. We have a cool hat. Generally don't remember us having that cool of a hat. Anyway, things by where they are you're also well taking uh, taking a little peek in my the in my YouTube. Chief of Papua New Guinea won a court order Wait a minute, what did I just open? <laughs> I think yeah. it's Electoral right, it is the... Uh, where is it? Let me find it. There you have it. <laughs> okay, pressing a media key when you're in YouTube might do some weird things. Uh, that's me watching the uh, Behind the Guilds documentary Oh, on No Such Thing as a Fish podcast. Uh, I haven't finished that previously. You know what? Just just so that it doesn't play anymore. I'm going to put it into watch later and I'm going to send there. But yeah, let's bring the music back in. So yeah, that is the... That is the... Um, the uh, premise of Jagged Alliance. And that premise is basically um, Enrico Civaldori, the president of Rulco, uh, got married to a person, um, I can't remember her surname, but I'm assuming she is uh, Civaldori as well. Uh, but uh, her name is Deidrana, and she started ruling the country with an iron fist at some point, uh, leading to her husband, now in exile, exiling. Or getting exiled, I suppose. And as such, Enrico Civaldori has contacted us, the player, <laughs> uh, to help with the uh, with uh, with uh, regaining the country under his own control. And hey there, Ricky! Uh, a large gem of boysenberry jam. I'll have to look up boysenberry, actually. <laughs> Let's see, boysenberry. If that's even, is it? Oh, boysenberry. Huh. Boysenberry is a cross uh, between the European Raspberry and European Blackberry, American Dewberry and Loganberry. Because on the picture it just looks like Blackberry. Huh. The more you know, I suppose. And Loganberry. Oh. I don't think I've ever had that one. Or at the very least, the one that I've, uh, I've have tried has been presented to me as Blackberry, right? I'm not... I'm not... Uh, uh, fruit... If you put in Blackberry in Google, it just shows you the uh, the smartphone. Oh, it's an absolute favorite. I wonder if it's available around here, uh, because um, there's a lot of... I mean, there's a bunch, let's just say. Where is it available? Ba -ba -ba -ba, cultivars, blah, 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 blah. California, okay. I mean, again, there's a, there's a possibility it is available over here in Europe, but... Until this point, I don't think it was familiar to me. I think I've seen the name once, or maybe a couple times, but never really it was. Uh... Yeah, so I'll... we're currently out of stock of boysenberry, but I'll be, I'll be happy to provide it uh, to you once uh, they bring it to us. <laughs> anyway, um, enough. I suppose I will we'll slowly start getting into the game. So yeah, I, th I think that's that's pretty much it. We've been hired as a group of special operatives to regain control of the country. It's going to be hard. There's going to be a lot of stuff happening. I'm doing the very, very final look at the in-game settings uh, because I am playing with a fan-made patch 
uh, called version 1.13 and it adds a million of things uh, including a very detailed configuration file that I'm currently quickly looking through everything has been pretty much set previously I had an idea to set something else and I right now I can for life of me remember where it was especially now that I'm trying to uh, think and speak at the same time and I should never do that I think we have everything, and majority of the stuff can be uh, can be changed in after we started the game. Anyway, so let's see. Can I can I get this going? Can I get this going? Let's get that jagged alliance on the road. So far, so good. Yep. Okay. Let's start off the music. Let's bring our screens. Whoa. Let's bring our screens. There we have it. Uh, it's also at times flashy. I do apologize if the flashiness uh, might get too much for someone. Uh, I'll try to make sure that it doesn't flash too much. So yeah, there was one. I, th I think it's me switching between the windows. But folks, welcome to Jagged Alliance. Um, I think volume-wise, we're doing pretty well. At the very least, the music is doing okay. Uh, again, we can change everything. Uh, did it, did it. Everything again was, should be uh, changed. So start new game. I'm gonna start at novice level. Uh, for uh, mostly for the purpose of this being a, a uh, the flag is like don't tread on me don't tread on me <laughs> and also a statue if, if you, oh actually maybe not the statue I think it's a person it's a person with a gun uh, and ten commandments whatever that is and a crown <laughs> never really paid attention also the flag is like a mix uh, uh, like a little bit of Austrian oh and Latvian as well in it uh, with two red stripes and one white stripe and one of the African countries, I want to say, Lebanon, so having like red, white, red. Anyway, uh, we set the difficulty level to novice, uh, mostly because uh, this isn't a challenge of me beating the game on hardest difficulty. Uh, this is a mostly like I want to play this in story mode, and as such, uh, I'll keep it as novice. It's still gonna be hard, um, but uh, I, th I think this gives us much better chance to get to the end and. This is uh, the most important thing. Um, inventory attachment is going to leave as this. Max West size as well. New traits. Normal stuff. Great, great. Available arsenal. Tons of guns. Uh, this really increases the amount of guns. Uh, the variety of guns available in the game. This does not mean that enemies are dropping like just machine guns everywhere. No. Uh, and we're going to switch the uh, game style from sci-fi to realistic because sci-fi uh, introduces something called Repetus. In addition to all the hubbub that is happening with the rebel, well, well, with the uh, dictator um, queen, with the with the army, with the rebel, whatever not, uh, sci-fi also adds aliens, or at the very least, some sort of like a uh, sci-fi bugs. So um, this really is not the main point of the game. This is not XCOM. Uh, we'll definitely uh, when I'll be playing XCOM, we'll get plenty of that. With this though, uh, I will be uh, using um, just a realistic one. Uh, I have chosen, uh, yep, I have indeed chosen the novice mode. Also, since this is a game from 1999, uh, interface might be a little bit small. In game, it's going to be somewhat bigger, uh, but right now it's going to be somewhat tiny. If this is an issue, uh, again, in full screen, if you're running the stream in full screen, it should be okay. Uh, other, uh, otherwise, uh, I might figure something else out. The, uh, unf the unfortunate problem is uh, I have to run this game in windowed mode. Otherwise, um, otherwise, alt tabbing and such is uh, very much affected. Uh, you alt tab once out of the full screen game, and bam! Yeah, I cannot alt tab back into it again. Alas. Anyway, uh, we are now uh, granted forty-five thousand American dollars to uh, recruit and just continue our campaign as uh, as we please uh, there is of course uh, there's a there is uh, this original email from uh, Enrico Chivaldori who recruited us you do not know me however I have been informed that you are in any position to help me I wish to avoid divulge details of my predicament electronically and wonder whether you can meet me at your earliest convenience yours truly Enrico Chivaldori but further to our discussion last night this accent just is just escaping somewhere else. I find your attempts agreeable. I will need a couple of days to raise the money. While I'm doing so, I trust you will be looking into my story and we shall be able to conclude our deal shortly. 
And finally, I'm available to meet you at Petrinska Kavarna in Prague at the time and date you prescribed. I will bring the funds as requested. And as such, yep, uh, we also get an, a little file on Arulcom. We can check that uh, quickly. Also, I like the Recon Intelligence Services. If you don't know where to find us, we don't want your business. <laughs> that is lovely. Um, information on Arulco's geography, history, and uh, the rest. Uh, so Arulco is a small, small third world country. Uh, it has varied terrain and climate. Uh, it has some like tropical parts to it, uh, some desert, uh, desert, desert, desert parts of it. Only on the third, right? Uh, one major city, nine smaller towns, two airports, um, medical facilities. Most of the country's uh, gross domestic product is derived from precious metal exports, specifically gold and silver. Uh, also, there's an industrial town. And yeah, a dictatorship under the guise of a monarchy for the past 10 years. Ruler Queen Deidrana Reitman, which suggests some German roots to her. Uh, and most government services, including education, were terminated approximately 8 years ago. Honestly, I'm not sure how this country is even functioning. And yet here they are. Uh, they've cancel canceled public health and welfare programs. But... This uh, this country, though, has a huge army, and that's the army that we will be fighting with our forces. Um, I don't think much is... I mean, there, there's, there's, a, there's a lot of stuff, and uh, again, the, the only additional thing that has already been mentioned, there's a group of rebels that we'll be meeting pretty much first thing in the morning. Anyway, we're going to start with... Uh, we, also have, uh, we also have a couple of websites already. For example, over here in the Association of International Mercenaries, uh, we'll be able to uh, recruit some of the mercs. And we'll be referring to them as mercs uh, throughout the duration of the playthrough. Uh, oh, there's also ads. I've never, I don't think I've ever stayed long enough to see the ad. There's also another option. Uh, there is the uh, Institute for Mercenary Profiling, and this is where we are creating our own profiles, including uh, my own and everyone who uh, is supporting the uh, Iron Gem community uh, by being a subscriber, by being a patron. Uh, for now, we're going to start with uh, just this channel's subscribers, and anywhere later on, we'll go for that. I do believe there's a limit of... Actually, I, th I think this is also adjustable, although at some point we might run into a specific problem. I'm going to show it to you in a moment. So for now, we're going to start with creating our very own mercenaries. For that, we need to go to... Uh, first of all, we need to note of this code, XEP624. Uh, and I do believe we can go to web and go to input. Okay, XEP624. And again, uh, this is basically character creation screen. So I'm going to be James Jarrington. I'm going to create uh, my profile first. I'm going to be male. Uh, there's appearance, uh, a series of uh, a series of a little uh, portraits that we can use. Uh, as it stands, for the majority of my playthroughs, I've been using this portrait. I think I'm going to go with it again. Time for the enemy to say its prayers. We also choose the voice for the character. We have some inconveniences to dispose of. Look. It's alive. Time for the enemy to say its prayers. We have some inconveniences to dispose of. So I think out of English ones, this is my favorite. Time to take out the trash. All, a lot of them are very macho. Uh, also, there are a selection of Russian voices. It's showtime. Oh, uh, this is not it just yet. This one. That's this one. <laughs> uh, a couple of them are basically that. Uh, well, I think actually every single one of them is a translation of whatever the English one says. Look, so there's a male chaotic, whatever that is. I, th I think this was a, like a leftover, perhaps in the game files, and the patch has restored it. Time for the enemy to say its prayers. It's hey, cool check. Yeah, it's time for enemies to pray. Uh, uh, something's like something's wrong, and time to take out the trash. I'm gonna go with this one, Russian one, uh, since originally I have played this game in Russian. I still have my Russian copy, and uh, a lot of a lot of character voices and everything uh, is still very memorable from that time. Anyway, uh, let's go. Uh, we gonna. Uh, this is. All oh, right, is this one? Uh, actually, oh boy, um, cancel. Okay, that's good. Uh. Okay, there's, this is our traits, and as far as I know, this basically adds... Yeah, 
this is a little a uh, little um, bonuses that we get for example sociable uh, better performance when a couple of mercs are nearby uh, and uh, disadvantages that uh, we gain no morale when no other mercs are nearby and then the opposite of that going solo yada 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 uh, optimist does not detect traps uh, intellectual uh, lower resistance to fires fire suppression and fear I think that's connected um, not primitive. Uh, there was one that I really liked and took previously. Higher chance to be hit. Oh no. <laughs> this is a game about shooting other people in, 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 at its core. So uh, <laughs> having one that is you are easier to hit is no, not looking for it. <laughs> Penalty in communicating with people. Oh boy. Morale for mercs of the same gender grows slower when nearby. Oh boy. So, seems like if we take show off, uh, if we're next to female mercs, um, we get a better, uh, we get a better uh, morale boost. Uh, gains morale when retreating. I think specific, I wanted to take pacifist. Let's go with pacifist. Uh, we can also take a disability. A couple of them will also show up in a, with some mercs that we might be able to recruit. Uh, I think the one I'm gonna take is uh, forgetful is horrible. Self-harming, ooh, occasionally harms itself. No thanks. Uh, this one can climb on rooftops. Inc drastically increased bleeding again. Don't want to bleed out. Short-sighted, deaf, and psychotic. No. Uh, the if you want to sort of min-max just a little bit, um, there will be tropical and desert sectors. I don't want to take that. You know what? I'm gonna take non-swimmer. I think this is the smallest one. Also, there's a chapter about prejudices. <laughs> I look average and the appearance is not important to us. Uh, this is all was not in the vanilla game. This is all added with the patch and you can really fine tune your character. Uh, what I will do is at the very least I will change this. Uh, unfortunately, while there is a big selection of uh, countries and people, for example, uh, we can be a Rolkan, which is pretty fun. Uh, Metaviran, whatever that is. Uh, all of a sudden, Estonian makes an appearance, but as far as I know, last time I checked. Uh, first of all, this is not a full list of people. Oh, people, countries. Second of all, Latvia is missing, so I cannot set my own. I'm gonna set as, uh, I'm gonna set it as Ukrainian since I have some roots down there. I am not racist and I am not sexist. <laughs> right. Uh, we can also get ourselves a couple of skills, and uh, these are, let's see, a uh, chance to hit with uh, automatic weapons, chance to, well, again, a couple of uh, tons of bonuses with hand-to-hand -hand combat. Uh, this is pretty much uh, somewhat ex uh, ex explanatory, I suppose. Uh, I think I'm going to take deputy, because everything else is like uh, shooter, shooter, uh, shooter as well. Uh, shooter must be yep uh, Another shooter. <laughs> this is for people who can shoot people uh, uh, people well, for people who can shoot people again This game is about that uh, Again shooting uh, technician paramedic and cover tops at least technician is repair paramedic healing cover tops is This is pretty interesting able to disguise as a civilian of s or soldier to slip behind enemy lines will be detected if performing suspicious actions having suspicious gear or being near fresh corpses uh, this is interesting. Uh, again, this is not from vanilla. What I'm going to do is I'm going to take deputy uh, because deputy is a little bit like a leader. So as such, uh, knowing that I'm going to be um, sort of running this playthrough, I'm going to take that. I can also take a smaller uh, trait and then I'm going to take radio operator. Uh, again, this is sounds like this is a like more of a commander thing. So I'm going to take that. Uh, there's also a background that we can take. There's a ton. Again, this is all from the newest patch. I think I've already uh, have already figured one that I want to take. Uh, bomb disposal unit? No. Uh, there was one like a. Uh, not this. There was like a again commander spotter. No, paired with a sniper. No. 
there are a couple of bad ones. Uh, for example, <laughs> Redneck is also a pretty bad one. There's the Mental Patient one. <sighs> B-movie star and a mime. What is mime? Better agility? agility? Uh, basically, you're more agile, more stealthy, more you have more camo. <laughs> oh, this is fantastic. Uh, I think I wanted to take veteran. Uh, yeah, was there like a commander or instructor? Uh, <laughs> Paramilitary instructor, just like Boy Scouts, but with violence, so not really like Boy Scouts at all. <laughs> oh, fantastic. I think there was like a leader of some sort, no? I might be misremembering it. I might be really misremembering it. Uh, let's grab, um... What was military advisor? Again, I, I basically want something for, like, leadership. Mm, Non-smoker. It's pretty interesting. Mm, interesting. Uh, you know what? Let's go with veteran. Again, I have played this game previously. <laughs> and finally, attributes. Uh, we are gonna go for a little bit of a... A little bit of an interesting approach. Actually, let me quickly, uh, let me quickly bounce. Do I have to have a good screen for this? Actually, I don't think I have a good screen for this, which is a shame. Yeah, I need a screen with without all of this. Let's actually do this then. Um, I'm going to quickly switch out out of this and uh, check a couple of things. Uh, specifically, um, Discord is calling. Oh boy! And Discord immediately starting to glitch out. Okay, these are announcements for. Uh, for a thing that will be happening tomorrow. More information on the thing that will be happening tomorrow uh, in a tweet that I will be sending out in, or, uh, or at least retweeting, uh, either today or tomorrow. Uh, Rocket League related, if you're interested. Anyway, uh, I quickly wanted to check uh, uh, one thing out, and that thing was... Uh, thing was... Was thing... Very specific thing about the abilities. Uh, let me quickly see. Yeah. So, um, let's bring it back on the screen. Uh, plonk. That's not it. This is it. Um, boop. Boopity boop. So, yeah. Uh, as you can see, we have a selection of uh, attributes that we can uh, uh, give to our characters. And um, the fact is... Um, all of these can be somehow leveled, and most important of them all is wisdom. Wisdom, um, wisdom uh, dictates how fast you can level up everything else. So as you can imagine, it is pretty darn important. Uh, but also health is important, dexterity is important, agility, strength is important. Uh, very specifically, I'm gonna I'm gonna bring uh, this down. Hello, will you like to be brought down? No. Ooh. Actually, maximum ship, I do not want to set that low. Explosives can go low. Uh, mechanical can go indeed low. Uh, also set medical to low, because we're going to have a medic. I thought I heard a follow noise. I'm now hearing hearing sounds, it seems. Um, what else do we have? Strength. Um, what is it that's... Uh, okay. Is there is there some sort of ooh there must be some sort of weird limitation on this um, uh, perhaps due to my sp other skills uh, because I should be able to should be able to drop leadership down but I think there's like some sort of hard limit on this one anyway uh, I'll I'll quickly uh, read up on things so uh, did it, did it, did it, did it, did it. Uh, for example health is self explanatory that's how much health we have. Uh, agility uh, mean uh, uh, is responsible for action points, basically how many actions we can take per turn. Uh, dexterity, I think, is our movement speed. Uh, absolutely. Uh, there it is. Uh, dexterity is for fixing stuff, so um, uh, repair, mechanical stuff, uh, throwing stuff, uh, and also hand-to-hand -hand combat. Strength is for punching people really hard, for carrying a lot of weight, and also force opening things like doors and uh, chest crates with a crowbar. Uh, and as I said, wisdom is dictating how fast everything else can be uh, 
can be leveled up. Leadership is for uh, organizing the local militia. Marksmanship, shooting things, which is pretty, again, self-explanatory. Explosives, setting explosive, uh, also disarming explosives. A medical, how uh, how well I, uh, we can heal people. And mechanical is fixing stuff, again, repair. Uh, picking locks and modifying items. You can sort of uh, do a couple of things on top. We're gonna go with this. And also, let's go with the new method. Let's see how that works. And I'm gonna switch back to this. Um, so, I don't think, yeah, it seems like once again we have... We don't have much. I was, um, I think it's down to my uh, low marksmanship rating, but I was hoping for some shooty tooty. And by shooty tooty, I mean I was hoping that I can get myself a, um, uh, a submachine gun. Unfortunately, I do not get that. I can take, get another pistol, uh, which I'm actually might get. Yeah, actually, let's get Sig. Uh, I'll actually get us a little bit more, uh, ammo. Uh, beer, uh, might be interested. Uh, and I'll sh tell you why in a while. Cleaning kit will be pretty important later on. Uh, and also you'll see there's a bunch of stuff. Oopsie daisy. A bunch of stuff will now be going outside of the screen, which is unfortunate. Uh, holsters. We have... You know what? Let's grab two holsters because we have two pistols and we're going to be finished. And we're going to be done. That's going to be me, James Jarrington. And authorized payment, yes, because uh, apparently creating ourselves as a character takes money. Uh, also, uh, now we can create more. And I will do just that. I'm going to uh, spend a little bit less. I'm going to just waltz through that. So once again, X, uh, XCP. We're going to begin. And last time I've checked, last time I've checked, we had uh, Yasmin and Dusa. Yasmin. Uh, I'm going to... Added the appearance. Uh, trying to remember. It's been a while since I've seen uh, Yasmin, actually. And I wish Yasmin was in the chat to ask how she wants to look. Um, this is sort of, I think, the, Let's get the, show on the road. closest up approximation. Okay, what about the voices? We've got trouble. Unfortunately, I don't think there's a German accent, uh, as uh, Yasmin is from that part of the world. Okay. Let's pop some zits. That's not it. Got trouble over here. You know what? How about this interesting voice? <laughs> now is the time to fight. Someone's here. Huh. Now is the time to fight. You know what? How, that one actually is pretty good. Also, notice just how many more female voices there are. I'm surprised. They're here. Let's get the show on the road. But no Russian voices, which is also interesting. Now is the time to fight. I'm gonna get this then. Uh, character. Uh, she is... <laughs> darn. Uh, I w uh, that's, that's why we need those people in a chat. Um, you know what? I'm gonna, again, just, just in terms of uh, going through this fast, I'm gonna just do this quickly. Uh, she is not German. Oh, she's not Ukrainian. Uh, she is indeed German. At least that's as far as I know. And I hope she does mind. She's also not sexist, thank God. Uh, she's gonna be... I think she's gonna be our technician, because I know that Yasmin does a lot of... Uh, uh, sh she programs. She... Uh, handles uh, tech pretty well. So I think she's she's gonna be our engineer. I think that, that fares pretty well. Uh, and... What can we add to the engineer? Bodybuilding. Uh, stealthy. Athletics. Survival. What about survival? Hmm. Snake evasion. Also interesting tracks. Track spotting. Never never spotted that. Uh teaching. No, I mean, mm hmm Uh let's put put survival. Uh and she is oh boy. We need to find a background for her. Again, she is she works in, in tech, so I'm gonna find one that is suitable for that. Uh, office worker, uh, that's not exactly it. Uh, tech quiz, there you go. And attributes, uh, I think I'm gonna do the same thing. Uh, max of this, uh, maximum, oops, uh, out of stuff already. Ooh, is it because something that we've picked? Oh darn. I'm gonna drop leadership to zero as well. 
Um, wow. Is it, is it again because we fixed something in her? We might have. Alright, well, we'll have our explosive and repair person, that's for sure. Oh, marksman stream is going to be low, but again, it's all it all can be leveled up, so it's not a problem. Uh, again, we might be having some issues hitting the broad side of the barn, but it's not a problem. Uh, uh, method. Uh, okay, she also gets a locksmith kit, a toolkit, fantastic. Uh, some camo kits as well, I think that's uh, through Stealthy. Uh, please don't glitch out. What else can we get her? Uh, I think she basically got everything. Canteen. Actually, canteen's pretty good. Finished. And done. And yes, I did. Fantastic. Let's go once again. Um, we're gonna get... Uh, we're gonna get our... Electri... Electrivin. Electrivin. Oh. Something like that. Uh, let's quickly make him a face, a face that is different from mine. I imagine perhaps Lactron looks like this. Time for the enemy to say its prayers. We have some inconveniences to dispose of. Time to take out the trash. And this will be his voice as well. <laughs> All right, uh, Electrovin. Um, right now, Electrovin is very busy with his real life. So as such, I almost want to put him as a loner, which... Oh. What was phlegmatic? Ooh, this actually could be interesting for. Uh, no, it's maybe let's put him as phlegmatic. Again, don't don't want to don't want to sort of label anyone. Uh, he's gonna be uh, once again uh, non-swimmer. He is, and here comes a very very uh, shameful part. I generally don't remember where Electron's from. I think the Electron's Dutch. So if there is, must be. I think I've seen Dutch at some point. Click, 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 click. Are you kidding me? Hit around, missed it. Yeah, I cannot possibly believe there isn't an option for Dutch. There's, well, I mean, a couple of these are because there are uh, mercenaries with the same nationality. Did I miss it? I was clicking pretty fast. There's African, just as a, oh, there it is, Dutch. Again, nobody's sexist. Skills. Uh, okay, we already have our... Um, we already have our uh, technician. How about we're going to have our... What's cover tops? Sneaky. Okay, I, I suppose since... Elect Oopsie daisy. Since Electron right now is AWOL. Again, this is a real right. I think being a stealthy kind of person sort of would fit that. Also, I think I can throw Night Ops on him as well, which is actually uh, stealthy, stealthy. Uh, and his background is, oh darn, Electron, what do you do? What do you do? Uh, <laughs> there, there's an option for Stalker, which is very good. Uh, <laughs> uh, he's very stealthy. I want to grab that. Again, I don't think that's uh, visible in any way later on. So as such, nobody nobody will know. <laughs> uh, there's an option for rebel. Uh, this is your country, your land, your people, and you have pledged your life to free them. Okay. Uh, let's go from the very start again. Um, I want to get something uh, that sort of fits with his, uh, with his uh, already selected skills and everything. Uh... Hitman, Wire Mob Stereo, Power Tripper, Gorilla, mm -hmm. could be. You're well trained in evading enemy forces and striking when they least expect it. Um, bombs are better. Faster running. Also, there's an option uh, in the mod settings to turn food and drinks. So basically, you need to feed your uh, mercenaries and also diseases. Again, for the purposes of not completely screwing up the whole thing, uh, those are off. And those are not on by default either. You, if you, if you really, really want your, uh, if you really want your uh, game to be hard, you turn those on. Okay, okay. Uh, as we can see, this guy is already very wise. We also make him strong and everything. Uh, explosive again. We don't need mechanical. We don't need. 
Um, could he be our leader? He can be our very good shooter. Actually, let me... Oh, cannot put lower than that. Okay, actually, let's, let's drop it down. I still need to uh, put some points somewhere. Unfortunately, I can't do that, so... Uh, he'll be our... Ah, oh, man. That's weird. I, I don't think that is that is a good option. So, how about he'll be our secondary medical... I almost wanted to call him a medical dwarf, but he is not a dwarf. Okay, do you get better weapons? Darn. Actually, sorry, cancel. Uh, cancel attributes next. That's with marksmanship. Well, okay, that's 80 marksmanship, so... Okay. I'm just trying to figure out, a, is there an option for me to get uh, a better gun? But so far, no. Uh, nope, no, 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 don't, 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 don't. Don't break my heart, Mikey, you break your heart. Utility knife, wire cutters, canteen pistols, mm -hmm. cloves. Interesting. <laughs> Finished and done. Uh, yes, I do. Uh, also need to watch, uh, uh, watch stuff. Okay, so. Uh, right now, and we can actually take a look at our folks. James Jarrington, Yasmin and Dusa, Electrovid. Uh, we have our... We sort of wish need a doctor. Uh, technically, we already will have a doctor, uh, but let's see. Uh, and I was going to recruit a doctor as well. So, Web, uh, once again. Uh, we will add our very last um, uh, subscriber, and that is... Darn. To my utter shame, I have forgotten the name of my uh, my last subscriber. Uh, oh, right. Flying midget. Uh, I mean, midget. If we're uh, doing a, a nickname, we're gonna put it as that. Uh, his appearance is gonna be. Um, he is from Latvia, as far as uh, and. <laughs> You know what? This this guy looks cool. Enemy to say its prayers. We have some incan time to take out the trash. It's showtime. You know what? Let's actually. It's alive. I don't want to take that. That is that is just too silly. That is too silly. Anyway, um, uh, you know what? Uh, uh, flying midget is gonna be sociable. Flying Midget, uh, once again, won't be a swimmer. Uh, flying Midget is going to be from... Um, I don't think Europe is an option, so that is a shame. Dee -dee 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 -dee. Uh, he will be a Rolkan, actually, just just for, for, for the funds of it. Skills. Uh, so yeah, we already had Technician. Uh, we already have Deputy Technician. Uh, we already have Covered Ops. Uh, he's going to be our shooter, I think. Uh, so let's get him... Rifles, shotguns. Shotguns, I don't think I have that big of an option. There is also one for pistols and revolvers. The thing is, pistols and revolvers will get out um, sort of out of class pretty pretty fast. We can get him as a uh, as our very like initial can fan the hammer with revolvers. That is so cool. He can be our like close combat fella at the very beginning, because pistols do not have a range. Hitting anything from a distance is impossible. Uh, heavy weapons. What is heavy weapons? Grenade launchers, rocket launchers. Wow. Uh, he's gonna be our sniper, actually. Let's let's bring it back to sniper. We we can. Then again, right now we don't have any weapons. Oh man. You know what? Let's go with gunslinger, just for a heck of it. And he's also gonna be ambidextrous, so he can shoot from both hands. You know what? Let's go with that. Uh, his background is... Is there one like... Uh, somebody who is a big show-off with, with his guns? Uh, big Game Hunter? No, just he is... <laughs> big Game Hunter! Travel to pristine nature, seek fascinating species, and kill them all! Oh, this is just... This game is something else. A Daredevil! Um, an imp imposing sight on the battlefield you are never one to shy away from taking the enemy head on <laughs> you know what I'm thinking about that if there's gonna be one like uh, there was something about circus I think oh competitive shooter um, no like oh. 
conscript. Uh, I swear I remember something like, uh, well, Hitman is an option. Something that will, uh, blight. Oh, oof. Uh, wasn't there, wasn't there not like a, well, there's an arms dealer. Deal, oh, there's the one for better deals, apparently. Okay. I'll quickly check for the, um, circus performer. And if there's one, I'm gonna go with that. If not, I'm gonna go with a competitive shooter. Kind of shooter. Uh, what does Thief do? When offered to take it or leave it, you always choose take. Steals money from locals sometimes. Wow. There's a wrestler, but again, that's hand to hand, which is that's not what we're going for. Uh, athlete doesn't really. No, that doesn't really go. Okay, I swear to God, that was like a circus. Uh, something, something. Uh, also Daredevil. Uh, I'm gonna quickly check. Mm, now, nah. let's go with where are you, competitive shooter, and let's go with attributes. Next, your marksmanship is gonna be the highest. He's gonna be our designator shooter for the start. Uh, I'm also gonna put all the points in the relative, uh, in the res uh, respect, respective. There you have it. Jeez, get a grip of yourself, Jam. In respective categories, also have 20 extra points. Uh, hmm. Will he be our? Yeah. Will he be our fixer? Yeah, another mechanic, I suppose. Okay. Uh, new method. I uh, guess to uh, tell. Even he does not get a uh, better weapon. Wow. Again, this is uh, the better weapon, the option to get a better weapon uh, when you're giving yourself a lot of marksmanship skill, is from vanilla. This is an advanced one, advanced version of it, so that's not exactly it. Uh, oh, actually, he starts with a laser sight, an extra mag. That's pretty cool. Uh, okay, done. Fantastic. So we already have four mercs uh, for now, uh, unless somebody from Iris, uh, well, again, the, the combined community of Iron Jam, uh, somebody who is supporting Ira on Patreon or, Patreon or her Twitch or anywhere else. Um, if you want a character created for yourself, let me know. Otherwise, this will be our starting four. Plus, uh, since uh, our best medic is still uh, only Lectrin, uh, I'm gonna go to uh, aim and hire one of the people over here. Uh, the problem is, the mercenaries that are here, I don't think we can actually see that anywhere. Employment, uh, they're free. With the exception of the initial cost, they are free. Uh, people over at here at AIM and later on at Merc are, uh, do require a um, little bit of cash. So let's see. Um, there was a very specific, uh, very specific person that I wanted to hire. I think I remember who that was. And again, apologies for a little flashing. <laughs> Actually, let me quickly check, uh, because there's going to be extra one. Yeah, her medical skill is not too high. <sighs> she can be a medic, but I'm going to I'm gonna take a, a very, like, a separate medic, basically. And I think I'm going to go with this. This person has a fantastic, uh, some fantastic set of skills, so we're going to go with her. So, folks, I hope she is available, because there's a chance she might not be. Nope, she is. Uh, Dr. Donna Spider Houston. Military trained in the treatment of trauma, Dr. Houston is virtually unequaled in giving medical aid under the most adverse conditions. On the darkest nights or during the fiercest tropical storms, the wounded can count on Spider to provide quick, quiet, and effective emergency care. Also, every single one of these has a little bit of additional info blurb. Uh, this one, for example, says Spider owes her nickname to an older brother who loved to torment her. Uh, some of them, they, uh, some of these uh, sort of s point to a secret ability that these uh, characters have. Uh, okay, so let's see. Um, covered paramedic, night ops. Ooh, what's this? Oh, emergency flares. Ooh, that is pretty cool. Um, hmm, hmm. Premium. I might actually go with that. Although, technically... Uh, actually, let me go to check. No, it is, it is the same kind of ammo. A weapon. What else do you get? Uh, empty, empty blood bag. What on earth is that? Uh, ooh, 
cold ammo. What is that? There's uh, different kinds of ammo also. Oh, and it actually shows your team has six weapons that use this type of ammo. That is fantastic. I'm going to go with this, with this option, especially since we have money to spare. So, what we do, we contact them. Dr. Houston, how may I help you? I would like to hire you. Okay, we should talk about how long a contract you had in mind. Uh, two weeks, and then we're going to extend that uh, later on, so... All right, everything seems to be in order. I'll report for duty. Uh, okay, so everyone will arrive at the same time to the starting sector. Wow, it's almost has been an hour. I've been talking a lot. Um, also, if we go home, if we go to members, um, once again here, there is a big selection. Actually, a couple of these I don't even remember. Again, a couple of these might be just the folks that I've never really bothered hiring. But uh, for most part, when I was starting my games, uh, way back in vanilla, ages ago, I basically did this. I sorted everyone by marksmanship. <laughs> and then I hired the... Actually, not just the top people. Most of the time it was Lynx, this fella. Yep, Lynx here. What's up? Uh, he seems like like an older gentleman. I, th I feel like at the very least that's that's the uh, sort of the uh, the impression that I got from him. He only he had um, a Roger Mini 14 with him, which is a great rifle f for a start. Uh, unfortunately, he might have also quickly run out of ammo, so um, that wasn't it. Um, sometimes I think of of I got in scope as well. She had an MP5. Yep. Uh, Reaper, not that much. Gus Starballs is a fantastic character. He is an army sergeant. Um, who else? Uh, this is the one of the best uh, mechanics in the game. Or Magic Walker. Uh, Raven, Spike. Uh, Owen Wilson is in this game under the name Robert James Sullivan. Uh, fantastic person, unfortunately. Right now he's on assignment, and maybe at some point we'll be able to recruit him. Ivan Dolvich. Oh, how I love Ivan Dolvich. Uh, his appearance in the Russian version of the game is a little bit diminished because everyone speaks Russian that one. Uh, here, the fact that he barely speaks any English is... I mean, stereotypes and everything. You could see he has Ushanka. He might have the red square behind him in a photo. Uh, but yeah. Ivan, a former decorated Red Army Major, joined uh, AIM uh, over three years ago. Despite serious difficulties communicating English, he took the mercenary world by storm, breaking all kill rate records and tallying up the kind of stats that perhaps only he himself is capable of breaking. Ivan himself says it's best. Gun. All gun. Like finger on hand. Uh, and in order to improve his relationship with com commanders, Ivan has enrolled in an English as a second language class. Love these. Uh, Carl Shadow Simmons is fantastic. He is, I think, well, no, not the only one, but I think in vanilla the only one who starts with like a uh, uh, camouflage kit. I used to, um, I used to uh, recruit him a lot as well. Uh, who, there's must be at least one more somebody who I like to recruit as well. A couple of these are uh, oh, Trevor, I think. I think Trevor's uh, oh, the, oh, actually, he is, I think, the best mechanic in the game. Uh, who else? Who else? Uh, Igor Dolvich, uh, Ivan's brother, which is also fantastic. Uh, Bruce Willis. A couple of these are, I mean, most definite, like, uh, copies of some... <laughs> Some characters uh, from movies and everything. A, a couple of mine we already might have scrolled by, just didn't notice. Okay, and I think that is pretty much it. A couple of these I think are from the previous game, maybe the original Jagged Alliance, because I don't remember seeing them when I was playing ages ago. <laughs> Marty Kaboo Moffat. Okay. And we're back to scope. Okay, so uh, let's take a short break, folks. And when we come back, the game will finally start. <laughs> we have finished the character creation. Uh, we have um, gotten um, everyone on, on board. And it's time to actually get on the ground in Arulco. 
and start freeing the country. First, we'll meet with the uh, rebels, the little resistance group. Uh, we'll actually uh, get a character from that group as well. And then we'll continue on just stomping through the country. Again, this will be a long play, a long let's play, I suppose. Uh, but uh, we're gonna go until we get bored with it or uh, until we finish the game by freeing the whole country by defeating Daedrana, the evil queen that currently resides in the capital. Anyway, a uh, quick break and then we will be right back with more of this. Actually, hmm. Fine. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> uh, I will be seeing you in a short while.
Alrighty, let's get back to the business of Jagged Alliance 2. Oh, and just like uh, just like when that happens, I immediately get some <laughs> immediately get some messages in Discord that I wanted to check. And now, now there's even more stuff that I sort of need to turn off for this to really properly work. Let's get back to this one. Let's quickly see who is this person who pingeth me. Oh, right, the Broomstick League uh, has its open beta happening right now. It's actually pretty fun, and there's also a person having yeah. Basically, nothing that should concern us right now. Let's just say that. Let's get jump uh, back down in, up forward, whatever, into the game. Anyway, as I said before, we are ready to start. So, this is the main, well, okay, maybe not the main game stream. This is a strategic stream for the game. This is where we are commanding all of our forces. We start in the city of Marta, the little town of Marta. And we need to go all the way to here, to this uh, sector over here, because... This is where Queen Deidrana is located. And obviously all of these uh, places, particularly around Meduna, are heavily guarded. There are tanks even. Crazy stuff. But we will start with slow and steady um, capturing and re reclaiming of these cities from the forces of evil Deidrana. Roll the start. And this is, this is me actually blocking one of the, oh, okay, so, let's see, quickly, quickly fix that then. Um, I think we look suspicious standing around like this. Ooh. flying in low. I had to look up to see the squirrels. I'm sure glad to have my feet planted firmly on the ground. Now. Which way to the rebel hideout? So, countryside uh, looks a little too damn quiet oh, for my liking. I say we find this Miguel dude and hanker down. There's an enemy presence. Okay, so um, first of all, I completely forgot uh, the fact that every single, every single mer, oh, sorry, every single player character, the created player character, likes to comment on things. Uh, since we have four player created characters, take out the every single one of them comments on. Yes. Okay, uh, and. Since I was just dilly-daddling too much, uh, actually the enemy appeared before we could actually do anything. Also very surprised, hmm, he has very wrong things equipped for this, uh, or at least the immediate immediate weaponage is not what I actually expected him to have. Oh, he's also... Oh, boy. Okay, I think I, I have time to sort of set this up just a little bit. Now he has pants over here. What on earth? Actually, did I just... Yeah, I was trying to figure out... Oh, and... Um, okay, I am doing some things perhaps slightly wrong. Uh, but one or the other... Electrovin has interrupted the enemy movement. He has spotted that the enemy is moving in there. Also, I dislike the fact that I see that enemy... I think he's holding a... What I... What I consider to be a automatic weapon. Which is very strange indeed. Mm. Okay, Electron's gonna go there. Has anyone else... Uh, how did I... Oh, darn. I don't think anyone else has done anything. Yes. Okay, yeah. so, uh, Spider. Gonna look there. Where yeah. is our... Okay. Characters, actually... Can I... I can definitely... Well, ah, because it's... Yes, it is... Ooh, I have two pistols. No, I, I should have two pistols, just the fact... The fact of the matter is, I don't need two pistols right now. Oh, new items just keep on popping in. Okay, I see how it is. Uh, can, I, really? can I place it there? Also have the, oh, I also have the letter and everything. This is all very confusing. Okay, I don't need two pistols, definitely. Uh, have I figured everything out? Yeah, I think I have. Anyway, the enemy is somewhere around there, so better be aiming for him. Yes. Enemies right now uh, are... Actually, oh, this is not the... F right, this is our move, so... This is why nothing is really happening. Uh, this is because... Right now, it's our turn. Again, tactical, turn-based. You, you have pretty much seen these games before. 
Uh, I'm actually gonna risk it, and I'm gonna put Midget straight. Oh boy! When I say risk it, I really didn't mean risk it. Midget. Okay, Midget was in the door, and that is bad. This guy's gonna see him. I'm sorry, Midget. <laughs> we don't need the whole place, Ricky. Um, would be an interesting option, but there are too many civilians, and we're not here to uh, to do civilian casualties. I am ready. Hey, Yasmin, with her accent. <laughs> Oh boy. Uh, I'm just quickly gonna plop everything everywhere. She has so many of those. Uh, Yasmin, 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 Yasmin. What can you do, Yasmin? I'm gonna bring her here. Yes. Alright, Electrovin. I'm gonna bring Electrovin over here. I'm gonna make him duck. I'm gonna make him look over there. So aim, basically, so he can, if anything, he can yes. grab an opponent. And by grab, I mean notice it. Also, there is a might be a problem with uh, my character commenting on everything in Russian, which is well, we'll see what will happen about that. With that, um, I'm gonna bring my guy. Oh boy, that is a problem. Yes, yes. Uh, let's just say I'm perhaps not the best player in this one. Okay, so I'm afraid. Yes. Ooh, yes. I'm surprised. I'm surprised that that guy didn't actually do anything. So I'm gonna. I'm gonna duck. Actually, I'm gonna even lie down. And I'm gonna aim in that direction. Uh, jam. Oh, God. I'm starting to remember. Again, this is um, the whole classic jams uh, idea, background, whatever you might call it, is Jar of Jam and the big nostalgia trip. And right now, that character voice that my character has, the Russian one, is bringing so many memories. I am. Ah, uh, God, I can't. I almost can't explain just how much. I am ready. Okay. Yes. I am ready. Uh, Yasmin, you are not ambidextrous, so I don't think you you should be carrying this weapon with two hands. Yes. Electron, I suppose you can move up just slightly. Right. And there you have it. So, uh, let's see the battle, uh, the main battle uh, mechanic in this game is that we can aim at various uh, parts of the body, for example, torso, the head, the legs, and damage our opponents. Uh, the more of AP, your action points that you spend, the more precise you get. A mission actually is one of our best shots. Let's see, can he hit the head? Oh, yes, he can. Super. And that... Uh, an enemy is already Not dead. Good. I am ready. Uh, okay, Yasmin has spotted an enemy. Unfortunately, this right now, that blinking cursor, and the fact that uh, behind me it says out of effective weapon range, uh, means that, yeah, we will be indeed, uh, she cannot shoot that person. I'm gonna move Yasmin just slightly closer, and I'm gonna keep her her aiming in that direction. Just heard a, noise. a good thing is, the enemies also do not have uh, yes. good weapons at the start, and as such, um, as such, they won't be able to hit us like with a sniper rifle immediately. They also have the pistols. Also, I've just found out that, yeah, one of the pistols that Midget has has a suppressor. Unfortunately, the other pistol does not have it, and as such, he's firing one with a suppressor, the other one without. Might have to do something about that, otherwise it's slightly stupid. <laughs> yes. Okay, who can see this guy? Midget. He can see the guy. Like uh, for example, legs right now, he can't even shoot the legs. The cursor is fully black, that that means cannot hit him. Uh, also, the torso as well. He can hit him in the head, uh, but the range is just too much. So for yes. for that then, I'm gonna just slowly move my people up. Same yes. goes for Electrovin. He's gonna be aiming in that direction. Uh, Jam is also gonna move, although there is a thing. I remember there being an opponent here somewhere. I might get I my yes. poor Jam screwed. Let's see. Yes. Interrupt for who? Electrovin. Okay. Too far. Uh... Oh. Wait a minute. Okay, 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 on the out of effective weapon range. I don't think he can hit him with anything. Sucker with the lowest body count buys drinks. And I think what he just did, he just drank from the container. Or con contain. Container is something else altogether. 
Uh, Yasmin, how are you with shooting? Uh, oh, Yasmin uh, is our uh, worst shooter. <laughs> so as such, um, don't think her her action will do anything. Yes. Midget. For funsies, can you hit the hat from here? As you can see, no, he missed. I'm gonna try it again. Anything else is gonna be a waste of my ammo, so I'm just gonna scare that guy just a little bit. Yeah. What spider just a little bit closer? Um, I'm gonna, I'm gonna move this. She does not need this right now. And we're gonna duck, and we're gonna look. There is, uh, I think, at least two more enemies in the place. That guy yeah. just does not know what to do. Uh, I'm gonna bring yes. Midget a little bit closer. Actually, uh, I'm gonna bring Midget straight on this weapon. Got it. So we now have an SMG, actually. Uh, unfortunately, it's actually it's not that badly broken, and uh, most importantly, uh, if you note, its range is 19. Uh, and as such, it is a much better weapon than he has right now, which also means he might be able to actually hit the guy. Uh, unfortunately, oh boy. Oh boy. Unfortunately, I haven't set up the holsters for him. I didn't know that would be a problem, honestly. Uh, so let's do this. Uh, are you... It's a holster. Don't tell me you can do one with the attachments. That will suck big time. Uh, right, so we have that. Uh, he also picked up ammo, right? And it actually should have ammo in it. And he's gonna aim. And if we can catch that guy just right. roaming around, I think Midget can actually yes. take a couple of shots. Okay, Midget, let's see what you can do. Oh, oh, don't tell me. Oh, this weapon. Uh, this weapon uh, is a rather simple and full auto only SMG, and that is the problem. It's full auto. Ah, thankfully, uh, full auto. Actually, I think there's a, there was a small change that the full auto no longer means like a, it really shoots every single bullet available. More opposition. There's enemies. Uh, that the enemies with good, uh, or rather the mercs with good trigger uh, discipline and good um, shooting skills and everything should uh, should not be just firing willy nilly. Yes. For example, here. Despite this weapon being in automatic mode, uh, our uh, midget is well. Okay, that was that was a little bit of yes. a, uh, a rapid shot. I'm also surprised he's still not hitting them, which is a darn shame. Jesus K. Christ. <laughs> Jesus K. Christ. I am ready. <laughs> okay, yes. midget. Let's try this again. Surely with this you should be able to hit. Maybe not. <laughs> also said, midget fires more rounds than intended. Uh, also. What did Spider? I think Spider just noticed something. Unfortunately, right now, the automatic weapon on Midget doesn't really give yes. us any benefits. Also, what happened to the guy over there? Oh boy, okay. I'm worried because yes. there's at least one more enemy over there, and I Jungle. generally do not know where they are. I'm gonna move, move Jam just a little bit closer. I'm gonna yes. move Spider a little bit closer as well. I think Spider was also not that good. Actually, 70 marksmanship, so... That's good enough for my my uh, purposes. I am ready. Okay, yes. let's try it again. Midget, again, you are our best shot. I think he's behind cover. That is the biggest problem. Uh, the, uh, it's, it's hard to see on this isometric map, but uh, I do believe the guy is just running over here and as such is behind cover. Unfortunately, it does seem like Midget is just outright missing everything, which with his marksmanship is very surprising, honestly. Jesus K. Christ. Okay, and there's Electrovin has spotted yet another person. Again, the distance is just not too efficient. What I'm gonna do, I'm gonna lay Electrovin down. I'm gonna keep on yes. aiming. Yes. Let's try it again with a midget. Uh, how about for the head? Nope. Need to reload. Uh, we'll do just that have the ammo. I need to start moving someone's closer. Uh, this is really not working right now. Uh, but I don't want to bring Yasmin too close. I also don't want to bring Spider. I just basically don't want to bring don't want to bring anyone in. Okay. Yes. Midget, come on. Uh, 
Nope. Now you've got my attention, says the guy who's now covering in fear. Yep, he is indeed covering with fear. We really got his attention. Uh, in not in the way he has intended, though. We're gonna move Jam. God. Those voices, I just, I cannot, I cannot yes. tell you just how much, how much Understood. nostalgia. Okay. I'm gonna stop uh, seemingly for whatever reason. Uh, despite the range being uh, okay, despite uh, Midget having a good, um, a good shooting skills, I cannot tell you why he's not hitting that guy. Uh, what I will do most likely, uh, well, I will currently will start uh, surrounding uh, these two guys uh, with several of my characters. Uh, let's quickly try to yeah. fast forward it. And okay. Oh boy, that was slightly more iffy than I intended. Okay. Uh, yes. Is he still aiming? I think he's still aiming. We'll see where that leads us. Yes. Interrupt for Electrovan. Again, Electrovan can hit that guy in, in anything. Somehow the... Okay, yes. this guy I think is, is uh, looking for... Got a gun jam here. Oh, that is the worst. Guns can jam. Okay, now all of a sudden he is hitting when I'm not doing precise shot, which is very interesting. Yes. Okay. That's pretty good. Uh, nope. We're gonna yeah. bring in Spider a little bit closer. Uh, we're gonna bring jam just like like this maybe or. How much do I need? I think I need this. I'm gonna lay him down. I'm gonna have him aim in this direction. Just again, if if anyone tries to surprise him, we're gonna surprise them. Uh, yeah. Spider is out of action points. Okay. Oh, yeah. this guy has found Spider. Okay, Spider will now shoot back. Um, so we don't go crazy. I'm gonna shoot in the torso. In the head, it's the most deadly, of course. <laughs> And I think the uh, spider's uh, phrase, I'm such a hypocrite, refers to the fact that she's supposed to be a doctor and she just killed someone. Do I still see this guy? I do. The question is, can or does this guy want to attack me from that distance? Yeah. Okay. okay, there's the weapon. That guy, I don't think he has fired at us once, which is pretty strange. Uh, yes. I will do... I think Electrin no longer needs to be craw uh, crawling, so I'm gonna bring Electrin closer. Yes. Team knows for Major Dax. He's gonna sneak like that, I and ready. I'm gonna bring Yasmin through here. I am ready. Uh, and usually AI is yes. much smarter than this. Uh, honestly, I'm not exactly sure. Okay. Yeah. I'm not exactly sure why AI right now is slightly iffy. Yes. Uh, could again be uh, the game sort yes. of is emulating the fact that we are in the starting sectors and as such people around here are supposed to be slightly yes. dumb, I suppose. Yes. Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna be aiming here. Jam. I'm gonna sneak up just a little bit more and take aim at there. Oh, that was not efficient, but yes. what can you do, I suppose? Uh, he's gonna be aiming through here. Yes. Electron really can move up. There's absolutely no need for Electron to be that yes. far away. I believe we've located all of them yet. Okay, and uh, as you saw there, uh, the tactical mode has now turned off. So we are no longer yeah. taking moves. Uh, which also means yes. that the opponent now is moving uh, with freedom, ready. just like we are. Now is the time to fight. That guy again. Uh, where can I put Electron? Definitely not in the way of everyone else, because I don't want her to get shot. And there is ready. friendly fire, no question about that. Oh. I am oh. Ready. Okay, Yasmin. Uh, how about you answer with the same? Okay, that guy's now hidden. Ready. It's yeah, she's aiming in that direction. Come on. Just I'm, the noise. There we have it. I was waiting for that guy to just appear. Uh huh. And so he appears. Are you telling me this is still out of range of my character? There is a huge penalty on shooting weapons behind their intended range. Oh boy, okay.
I'm also hoping, and actually this is a setting that I really should have checked, is whether reinforcements from other sectors uh, are allowed. Uh, technically, uh, in Omerta, or actually not just technically, this is the only sector in Omerta that actually has anything in it. Uh, with, well, enemy-wise. Okay. So what I wanted to do, I wanted to... Ah, uh, down this is... In many ways, this is suicide. Okay. Uh, jam? Okay, Jam can now shoot. Yeah, pretty successfully. And bam! Target has been destroyed. No enemies, just casualties. <laughs> Alright, uh, and bam! We are done. We are done with this one, and why did it just... I swear to God, the screen has just gotten darker for whatever reason. Anyway, the fight is over. We can actually go to the main map and turn on this, since I I am too lazy to actually check every single body. Wait a second. Is there really only three enemies? Let's come back. I sort of got there were I was there were supposed to be more. Again, we're playing a novice difficulty. I think this is affecting it. Okay. He said. With a little raise in the voice. <laughs> um so yeah. Uh, we can now grab a couple more weapons. Um, Stetchkin FPS, uh, range 13. I'm pretty sure we're good on that because uh, most of us have this uh, slightly better pistol, the Stetchkin. Uh, unfortunately, the Stetchkin requires ammo, different kind of ammo. And there's a, therein lies one problem of turning on uh, tons of guns. It's the fact that uh, some of the guns are using a different ammo type. Stetchkin is a Russian gun. So as such, he's not using nine, uh, uh, nine nine x nine uh, nineteen millimeter uh, ammo. It's using nine x eighteen millimeter ammo, and as such, it's only compatible with with those. Uh, but uh, the good thing though is we have the uh, Pepe Shah. Uh, this is weapon from I think the World War Two. Uh, or thereabouts. Uh, so first of all, it is. It is. It counts as SMG, as far as I know. It has a huge drum magazine, so we won't be won't be uh, down on ammo. And really, this pretty much almost allows us to immediately uh, immediately equip a couple of folks with pretty good weapons. So, I think. You know what? I'm even thinking like this. Um, this will be our doctor. I'm gonna I'm gonna give uh, Pepe shot to Jam. So he gets that. He gets ammo. Both of them. Oh, Dorn. Dorn. Uh, don't tell me that's yeah. There we have it. Uh, good, 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 good. And Stetchkin, I won't even touch for now. There are gonna be more guns, so we're gonna still be equipped. Anyway, we now have a thing to do. Uh, there is. A very important NPC over here that we need to talk to. There's Pacos, the little boy. So cute. And Why there is you here? Fatima. Or Fatima. How could it be that you were sent by Enrico? He has been dead for more than ten years. Okay, I'm gonna give you a very important thing, which is letter from Enrico. Hmm. A letter from Enrico Chivaldori. Indeed it is. He has not forgotten us. Indeed he hasn't. Very few people are aware that he's alive. As far as most of the people in Aruko are concerned, he was murdered over a decade ago. Thankfully we he's still alive. We had given off. up hope of ever hearing from Enrico again. Who would believe that someone living in the comforts of exile would care about this dismal country? Well, it's Enrico's Very country, well, really. Then. Follow me. Do not make any quick moves. Miguel's men will be nervous. You do not wish to intimidate them. The Drana has brutally bombed and attacked us for over two straight months. Yeah, really, let's let's also point out that this place is just bombed and these houses are not fit for living. This is a war zone, but again, it's a civil war zone, really. Yes. So yeah, we, now in this uh, non-tactical mode, we can select everyone. Unfortunately, everyone chimes in whenever I'm moving them, so that's a little bit silly. Uh, let's move everyone. Let's move everyone to the next sector. 
Could we please yeah, everyone just make their move? Yeah. Okay. And we are about to meet the main, well, and the, the only resistance force in uh in this game. Yes. And that is Miguel and his and his people. Fatima is uh, Fatima is doing her best impression of a es escort quest NPC. She's escorting us, but if we actually just stray, we can actually just go somewhere else. I can, I can, for example, send everyone into the house, uh, and then she will stop. <laughs> she'll wait for us to return, and uh, then she'll continue. So sometimes you can even sort of impede your progress with her. Anyway, let's be extra friendly. Have you lost uh, your mind, woman? You bring please welcome Dimitri. They have been sent by Enrico Civaldori. They're here to help us, Dimitri. They must speak with Miguel. I would never bring them here without proof of this. In respect of your husband, I take your word. We will go down. But if you make mistake, Fatima, you will die with them. And so we go and quite literally this is the underground resistance because here we are in the underground place move, and no one will Carlos uh, right hand of Miguel they are here to help us she says she have proof Carlos Enrico has enlisted mercenaries That's to aid us. us in the struggle I have a letter addressed to Miguel it is signed by Enrico himself and contains details of the night we helped him flee Auruco details only he would know and now he came back well not just he Silvatori? Mm. Most oh, suspicious. suspicious. I question his reasons. Uh, is it now? No, that's Miguel. I do not. Let me see this letter. Here. Hmm. Very important voice line. True. Enrico has sent men to help us. On behalf of my rebel force and the people of Arulco, I welcome you. We are very much in need of your aid. And now? Wishes to remove Please welcome. The from the map of this country. She is evil, a driven this character. Bitch. That will do, Ira. By sure the name of Ira. Have heard of her nature. If not, they will know soon enough. Well, she better say her <sighs> prayers, Miguel, because she's got another thing coming, like a bullet to the head. Oh God. To be on board. Oh midget. <laughs> I have lost over thirty men in the last month. My force is down to the people you see here. But I do have a few trusted people living in the Arulco countryside. The people of Arulco would overthrow Didana with pleasure, but they live in fear of her, and rightfully so. She be heartless and brutal. She has robbed our country of its money and its soul. Getting their confidence be our biggest problem. The people must feel we are capable of defeating her. It's a noble cause, really. Without their support, we cannot. We are missing soldiers and equipment. You could not have come at a better time. Um, pretty down on equipment as well. We need safe passage to Drasen, or more people will die. Yes, Carlos be my close advisor. He is right. He usually be right. Making a safe for no reason, Miguel, despite speaking a uh, good English, if you can is making some weird mistakes. There is a priest in Drasen named Father Walker. He be a okay. drunk of poor judgment. However, he will be sympathetic to our situation. Find him and tell him no more than you need to. So we're now on a quest. I will send others to fetch the supplies he will gather. I wish you luck and express my gratitude. I have faith in us. Victory will come. All right. So uh, we've been now sent on a quest to move to a different town, Dressen. Uh, capture it, free it, I suppose, and then uh, ask the local priest, Father, uh, Father who again? I already forgotten. Um, okay, we can go to the laptop actually and go to history. Uh, no, does not show actually. Uh, but that uh, priest is drunk. Uh, chances are we're gonna find him in a bar. And it's pretty silly. Anyway, uh, so yeah. We've, we've met uh, we met a couple of people in the resistance uh, Miguel and Carlos uh, will be staying in here for uh, at least for the first half of the game I think uh, Dimitri might join us uh, soon enough and we might as well grab him at the point that he's available more more people the better I suppose 
And most importantly, we can immediately recruit Ira. I'm Ira. I came to Oroko five years ago as part of an effort to supply humanitarian aid. I soon realized the only aid they needed was in getting rid of Deidreana, by whichever means possible. So, yeah, Ira is not from Arulco initially. Uh, I wonder, actually, um, actually, I have no idea where she's from, but... Miguel's rebel force has been together for almost two decades. They are trustworthy and loyal. They will accept you as one of their own as long as you do no harm. And we will recruit Ira. You can do that with a couple of NPCs. Uh, some of them would just flat out refuse. Some of them uh, might tell you something that they need. Ira will just happily oblige. All right. Oh, I right. can be of help with some of the ins and outs of this country and its people. She's helpful. But I must tell you, I'm not a professional like you guys. Uh, she... I'm afraid my marksmanship is a little weak for a soldier. Oh. Miguel used me mostly as a medic and a lookout. Anyways, I'm sure we'll make out okay. Let's get going. I'll lead the way. Uh, so yeah, uh, Iris is pretty good in the sense that she is... Well, she's not. she was not born here, but everyone treats her as a local and as such um yes. it is uh, it's pretty pretty simple for her uh, and pretty helpful hmm. for her to talk to people uh, around here so yes i think midget should grab grab that got it uh, was like a singular one okay i am ready yes nothing nothing anyway how close we are? Oh, we have twin. Oh, we also have another series of frame drops for that reason. So yeah, uh, now basically the game begins yes. and just still can get used to like me selecting everyone and I don't even need to select everyone. Uh, but now the game begins and on really, we can do anything we want. I mean, from here, we can even go straight to Maduna and finish the game immediately. Uh, it's not the smartest idea that you can do uh you'll be under under leveled under equipped and as such you really should not be doing that uh so first we need gonna go the uh that route uh and go to drassen we're gonna follow the road and see where that leads us uh and also we get a little bit of a glimpse in the royal palace in which daydrana resides let's go uh, these are basically Cutscenes. This better be good. Daydrana. Forgive the intrusion, Your Highness, but one of our North Patrols. And this is Elliot, her advisor. Daydrana likes to hit Elliot a lot and call him an idiot. How can it be? From what we have learned, Your Majesty, the rebels seem to have some sort of foreign aid, commando types. We speculate they arrived on the helicopter that was spotted earlier. Uh, fair enough. Commando types? What sort of commando types? From where? They may be hired mercenaries, your highness. There weren't many. Our, our jig is what? up. How would the rebels get the means to recruit mercenaries? Well, no matter. Send me their bodies for examination. And the rebel party seems to have used the element of surprise. To yeah, their he hasn't advantage. started this way. My queen, our people have been killed. They defeated us. Send my troops to the location at once. Uh, yes, your This highness. also means that the Amerta, I think, will be recaptured. Uh, but uh, we're gonna we're gonna figure it out later. It's not that big of a problem right now. Uh, but yeah, also I'll, I have to give it to them. Uh, the fact that we have arrived on the helicopter made a whole lot of noise uh really does not make our situation that uh that uh, secret <laughs> okay so uh let's go i'm trying to figure out oh there we have it someone is here indeed someone is here and not only in the cities, but also everywhere on the on the map, we will be meeting some of the enemy squads. Again, at the very beginning, it is not that big of a deal for us to fight them. Actually, I, I'm even gonna group my uh, my mercs like this and see what we can do. So, first up in the order, uh, actually, I'm gonna mark yes. everyone, and I'm gonna. Yes. 
Oh, don't tell me. Oh, don't tell me. Yes. There. Everyone's now gonna be stealthy. I'm gonna send Jam and Midget yes. as the first people. Sneaking up high, uh, because they have the best weapons. And as such, they will spot the enemies earlier than everyone else. Uh, not, not just uh, spot them yes. earlier than everyone else. Yeah. But also, they are the enemy there. To say its also, also, we'll be able to shoot them from a much larger distance. So, uh, stealth mode is no longer relevant. Although, uh, technically, we can actually still sneak. So, I'm, I'm going to actually keep I it. Hear yes. Un until we get spotted, we really can move like this forever. Okay, I think yes. we've been spotted. We've definitely been spotted. In which case, I'm going to be enemy. loud. I'm going to aim in that direction. Uh, did Jam... I don't think Jam has made it. Oh, no. Jam has actually made it pretty far in. So, Jam is gonna... Uh, Jam is gonna lie down, I think. And just aim in this direction. I don't want anyone rushing Midget right now. I am ready. Yes. Uh, unfortunately, everyone else has a pretty yes. shoddy weapon. Uh, in terms of... Yes. Range. So, I suppose what I will do is... I'm gonna bring a couple of people here again. With the purpose of just providing some cover. And yeah, I think this is the best idea is to actually get them all out of yeah. sneak mode and get them you all out of uh, crouch. Yeah. You got my ear. Enemy moving all the people here. Right. I'll kill you, says that guy. Misses three times from a pretty close distance. You got my ear. Left after that. And. Yes. Oh boy! Oh, and he immediately disappears. Well, that is a problem. Uh, come on. Okay, he's aiming at the right spot now. I am ready. Okay, Yasmin. Let's see what we can do. Oh, that's two enemies over there. Okay. Uh, I'm yes. gonna send. I'm gonna send you over here. Oh, he's still crouching. Darn. He does not need to. You got my ear. Mm. Yeah. I need I people ready. behind cover, basically. Which means just sending them out in the open is a yeah. bad idea. I am ready. Yeah. Mm, darn, where would you send you, Spider? No, oh, she can't even turn. Okay. Got my yeah, I am ready. Jam. Seized, but cannot really shoot. I need that guy much closer. Okay, let's see. Yeah. Jam has intercepted the guy. Oh, still too, still too far away. Uh, what Jam can do... Oh, Jam is in some sort of a bush that... Oh, boy. Yeah, I've just led Jam into a pretty weird spot. Uh, let's lie down, and can I... Oh, darn, I don't have enough. Uh, I might actually... Okay, I'm gonna wait. That guy that Midget has been fighting will appear again. Yes. Ooh, thankfully missed twice. And get hit once, unfortunately, darn... That all interception business did not give him many action points, only one shot. Still, that guy has already been hurt. This is a good start. Yes. And that guy's still standing up. Oh, that's been a little bit of an overkill. Nighty night. <laughs> Nighty night. Uh, and this also allows Midget yes. to turn around, uh, take a name, and if anything happens, he can act. I am ready. Okay, Yasmin has spotted these guys. Again, range is not ready. is not allowing. Still too far away, darn. Okay, jam aims. That's good. Yes. Pinjit. I'm gonna let him come. I am ready. Uh, Yasmin once again spots that guy. I uh, keep on looking that direction, Yasmin. Yes. I'm basically gonna look at their actions. Midget repositions. Takes a little bit of a blast. Unfortunately yep. misses. Jam. Darn. Again, he has a automatic Ooh. weapon. It's pretty good for just just going full on auto rampage and just basically uh, suppress uh, the opponents, the enemies. Uh, unfortunately, yes. Oh, darn, he had to reposition. Uh, unfortunately, still the range is not great. I am ready. Oh, ya Yasmin is really good at spotting these enemies. Also, I'm not sure what this guy is currently yeah. calling. I really hope these these are not reinforcements. 
One way or the other, uh, Midget is right now not available. Yeah. Okay. Yes. Come on. I wasn't aiming. Um, that might have been the problem, really. <laughs> that guy just keeps on doing the same thing. He keeps on uh, calling more people. And we might be actually in a little bit of trouble if they do indeed manage to call something in. Call someone in. Are we good? Oh, there's something happening in the background. I dislike that very much. Again, at this stage in the game, we are not supposed to get anything crazy. Yes. Nope. nope. Uh, I didn't want to toggle keys. Thank you very much. Whoop. Missed it. Okay, let's try. Ooh. Can you not? I hear you. No, that's not the button I wanted to press. Oh boy. Yellow. I think the jam will just move on up and take aim. Oh Christ, this the system is a little bit off. Okay, jam can finally hit that guy. Jam can finally hit that guy. Jam can hit. Jam cannot hit. Yes. Okay, let's see, midget should now have a perfect chance of shooting at that guy. Need to reload. Ah, uh, and he does not have enough to reload. Up, that guy's that guy's gun just jammed, which is good news for us. Uh, still pretty sucky. Okay, uh, let's do this. Uh, first of all, I really wanted to bring these people closer, so um, I'm gonna risk it for Yasmin. I hope that they will shoot other people, the people they've already yes. seen previously. Okay, first of all, reload. Second of all, head. I think it's easier to hit in, uh, the person in the head when that's pretty much the most, the uh, the biggest part you see as they're lying towards you. Uh, okay, what about you? Your torso should be pretty good. Jam, come on. Jam. We've talked about this jam. Oh, darn. Yes. Accuracy on this guy sucks. Oh, I once again forgot to move people closer. Uh oh. Does not count. <laughs> Close does not count. Good thinking, Asma. Good thinking. I so wish they are not bringing the reinforcements in. We should be able to deal with it, but I am very suspicious. Also, I don't remember this game taking that much on these on these turns. And once again, the uh, Windows wants to know whether we want to do these sticky keys. Yes. Because I'm trying to use like skip the things, uh, like sp speed up the the game thing. No, these are ah oh, no this. I'm specifically... Okay, this works. Nighty night. Nighty night. Nighty yep. night. We're good. Once someone notifies their next to kin, <laughs> we can move on to the next sector. Up, oh, Ira says the same line for whatever reason. I wonder. Again, this is... Uh, since this is uh, an unofficial patch, uh, and this is technically a, like a development version, there might be some, some weird comments. Okay, what do we have? Uh, we have more weapons for... Uh, basically, we have the same weapon that Ira already has. I'm gonna grab some more ammo for her. Uh, and this is... I think this is, yeah, Makarov. So once again, a uh, pistol with the ammo type that we are we are not using. So, not really interested in that. Let's keep on moving on. Nobody has been hurt. Uh, so let's on continue moving to Drassen. Roger. Okay, and there you have it. Drassen. Enemies have been detected in this area. There's, uh, there's a bunch of people around, but we should be okay. So go sir. And we're coming into the Drassen Airport. Uh, once again, I think what I will do is well. There are two routes. Uh, previously, in my like test game, when I was just trying to figure out whether everything's working a okay, I've brought everyone through the top, and this is still an option. Uh, we can actually go through. Actually, it's pretty interesting because maybe there's a switch of some sort, but I think this marks that this fence is electrified. Those little yellow signs. Uh, one way or the other. I am ready. Uh, was it like a? No. That's not what I was looking for. Uh. Uh, don't also don't shoot, please don't shoot. Yes. Hey, everybody, crouch. Also, yeah. Also, this is this is a weird, uh, weird view, but uh, game 
at the very least right now, automatically removes the treetops so you can see what's happening. Otherwise, people are just getting hidden behind them. So let's quickly move around. I know there's going to be a person over here. And there's going to be a person over here somewhere. A bunch of them crowd around here. Uh, which one of you... Okay, Jam. Actually, a couple of them, including Yasmin, have the uh, wire cutter, so they will be able to cut through. So I think what I will do, I'm going to bring Jam a little bit closer. Nope, nope. Darn, that's not what I meant. I'm going to send him back. Uh, are you not going to? Oh. Mm, are you? Oh, because, because Jam is not selected on the screen. Come on, game. Give me... Give me some cooperation, please. Uh, actually, you know what I will do? We didn't get them all. Yeah, that's gonna be good. I am ready. Yasmin uh, and yes. Midget will move on up. Yes. Actually, I think I'm even send Ira with them. Yes. Understood. Now is the time to fight. Has he spotted us? No. He I hasn't. am ready. Okay. That's the most important yes. bit. Uh, Electra? He was there somewhere. You got my ear. What's up? Uh, okay, let's, let's once again wait. You got so, technically, my ear. we are in the, like, in the... You got my ear. It, it's... I am ready. It's middle of the day, so technically yes. we are, we should be pretty, pretty visible. But there is yes. limits to visibility for yes. everyone, so... There is a possibility that really yes. he cannot see us. Or at the least he's not paying enough en enough attention to sort of really spot... Oh, there's, there's someone. On it. Okay, we didn't see them again. I'll try my best not to look in that direction, otherwise I will just keep on triggering that thing. I am ready. Yes. Now is the time to fight. Uh, okay. I am ready. Hasn't spotted us. Hasn't spotted us. I am ready. Sort of just looking in our direction. I am ready. Okay. I don't think he's he's gonna get it. So, Yasmin is gonna take out her wire cutters, and oh, wire cutters, Yasmin. That is. That's what I'm trying to do. Mm, let me actually take... Oop, see Daisy? Let's put the pistol away. Maybe that's the problem. Uh, I'm not sure what's happening, actually. She should be able to just cut through. I don't want to build. What is... Wire cutters, right? I generally don't know what's happening. Uh, the icon that should appear should be completely yes. different. Uh, okay, you he does not have it. Yes. Oh, Yasmin is our like uh, mechan. Is it because she has a mechanic skill? What is going on? Or can she, can she not silently cut the? Okay, I think it was just a visual glitch. Okay. So what we'll do? Uh, we'll yes. bring everyone in. Or at least I'm going to bring everyone as close as possible. This is a little bit stupid, the way I'm placing these characters. You got my ear. Yes. Uh, because they are ready. technically... Everyone is... Yes. Okay, I've just made a horrible mistake. I uh, got ready. them all spotted. Yes. <laughs> you got my ear. Yeah, you ha he has a sighting, and now he will inform everyone on the map, which is bad. Yeah. Jam's gonna aim there. Yes. Spider's gonna aim there. Yes. Electron's gonna aim there as well. Yes. Okay, so. Ready. Uh. Ira is gonna move here. Yes. Midget is gonna move here. I'm gonna cover this angle, this angle, and. I am ready. As much of this angle as possible. I am ready. I have a suspicion that they're gonna come through here. Okay, she's out yes. of action points, so no. He's out of action you points. Is anyone ear. not of action out of action points? I think it's my people over here. They're gonna start surrounding us at some point, so yes. yeah. Despite the oh God, despite the sort of stupid um, stupid AI that we saw previously. I am ready. Right now they can they have a great possibility of actually flying you us and everything. Ear. So what will happen, Ira? Oh, doesn't have enough action points. We're gonna cover this angle, this angle, and maybe this angle as well. Again, there's a person over there. Ira gonna be looking in there. 
And yes. right now, Electrovin and uh, Spider are not going to do much. Yes. I'm going to send them up. That guy. Actually, I'm considering even yes. to... Yes. Uh, yes. Actually, Spider is okay. slightly closer. Yes. Got that is not the way you do it. Please. Okay, there you go. I am ready. Uh, Yasmin, oh, first of all, Yasmin needs a gun. It's all fine and dandy that she has a pistol, but... Uh, we need to... Okay, so Yasmin, uh, your, your action is going to be... You're going to lie down, you're going to start aiming. Again, anyone who's going to be in your way, you're going to shoot at them. I am ready. You got my mm, ear. I need to set Ira to aim as well. Yes. Electrovin still trying to be as sneaky as possible. Yes. Spider will try to be as sneaky as possible. Oh, Spider is. I'm just asking for Spider to be shot. Oh, surprising enough, it's Electrovin who got shot. Yes. But again, it's easy to hit people when you can yep. shoot a million of bullets. Yes. Um, you know what? Uh, I think the time for uh, stealth is over. Yes. This is now full blown full-blown attack and everything. Yes. Okay, Electrovin, I think, can make it to here. And will not have enough. Ooh, I'm just setting up Electrovin for a lot of trouble. I'm very sorry, Electrovin. Yes. Okay, so. Let's get revenge on this guy. Oh, that is... Worse than I anticipated. Okay, good shot. Another one. Ah, oh, we needed that second yeah. shot. We really need, well, that last shot anyway. You know what will happen? I think I'm going to send Spider up here. Unfortunately, she won't be able to shoot immediately, but at the very least, um, she will be able to shoot at some point. And oh, I don't need that. Again, these guys, the these guys are no longer... Oh, interesting. Someone came from the top. I think they made a hole themselves. Huh. That is very in interesting. We're gonna keep an eye on them. You got my ear. Keep it in mind, there's a person over there. Uh, right now, yes. still the person with the best chance to hit that guy is gonna be Electrovin. Unfortunately, he's hurt, and also cannot really aim as yes. good as I expected him to. <laughs> Didn't I mute the microphone? Oh, it because. Uh, something something about the game sort of uh, using a each and one of my inputs. Anyway, that was a wasn't a loud sneeze anyway. Oh god, she cannot hit him. Unfortunately, she's out of action points anyway. Uh, problem is, well, stupid problem really is the fact is that I sent Jam with the uh, with the uh, weapon with the biggest range. Wow, 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 wow. somebody's gonna get hurt and they're gonna yes. be me. It's gonna be you, man. It's gonna be you. Uh, who did you intercept? I think you intercepted this guy. Okay, so I'm gonna turn around since I think uh, Yasmin has that covered. And that guy's about to get covered as well with bullets. Not good. <laughs> Not good. Uh, yes. Really isn't. Darn. Oh, come on. Okay, that is not a problem. Spider. Okay. I think Spider can finish this guy. Oh, that's a good shot, Spider. Eureka! <laughs> Kill confirmed. Also, Electrovin. Uh, Electrovin now likes uh, Spider more, and Electrovin just gained one level of experience. Yes. Uh, was his wisdom lower than everyone else's? No, wisdom is the same level as everyone else. Weird. Anyway, uh, let's proceed on. Uh, first of all, Jam needs to move in closer. Again, the person with the gun with the longest range. Okay. He should be... Yes. Uh, bam, good. There's another person here. Uh, who else do we have? There's six in total. We can now have... Uh, okay, good. Oh, boy. This is not good. This is not good. This is not good. I'm going to reposition uh, Yasmin. Oh, his gun jammed. Oh, thank God. Oh, she had to reposition again. Well, that is a shame. Uh, it just isn't available. I am ready. 
Okay, Yasmin, show what you're capable of. Ooh, good shot. Good shot. Two shots. Fantastic. How promising. So yeah, I think there were six people in total, and we have confirmed one, two, three... Wasn't there a fourth one somewhere? I could swear. More opposition. More coming from uh, that yes. little building over there. Electrovin, uh, Electrovin also does not need to sneak anymore, so he's going to still proceed like this. Spider yes. has now spotted him. I'm going to bring uh, Jam to here. Yes. Uh, I don't want to bring Spider here, uh, purely because she's going to get in the crossfire. So for now, um, how about you just lie down? Ooh, that is a problem. It makes so just a hard target. Yeah. Oh, only you too. Okay. Enemy. Okay. What was that? Okay, Ira heard something, and I I will wait because I have my suspicions. Oh, actually, uh, not necessarily. It's not necessarily something evil. There are actually civilians in these buildings as well. So there is a complete chance that yeah. it is. Nothing to do with an enemy yes. coming over there. More opposition. Okay, that's the second one. I wanted to, him to come here to and aim there. Okay, not yet. Spider. Ah, uh, she's gonna get be ducking. Okay, I think that's that's gonna be better. Uh, jam. Aim there. Yes. Spider. Aim there. Oh boy. Jesus came okay, so that's three. Okay, that's the yeah. remaining three. Uh, which means that I can immediately... Oh, darn. It's Spider. Uh, spider's out of range. Again, the start, of the game start of the game, unfortunately, is... Oh, no, there's another person here. Oh, it was seven after all. It's good that I... Oh, boy. It's good that I haven't had a chance to get all of these uh, characters uh, out of there yet. More? Okay, I completely misjudged the amount of people on this map. You oh, you know what might be happening? Oh. Yasmin? Okay, well, Ira got this. Uh, pew! Pew! Wow. Ira is fantastic. I think, uh, you know when, when on the tactical map we saw some people above the sector, in the sector, and below the sector, I think people from above the sector actually came in. Otherwise, we are having many more enemies than... I mean, this is more enemies that we should have, really. Um, Gotta pull out of here, now! Oh, and then one coming in. Yeah, I'm, 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 yes. I'm positive. I'm positive that's what's happening. Uh, no more sneaking for uh, this guy. He cannot see anyone there. Oh, God, I hate this. Right. Aim there. I'm just gonna... Uh, do this. I am ready. And oh, he does not have enough time to come back. Okay. Uh, he's not gonna be. Uh, he's not gonna be looking in that direction. Okay, Electron. Yes. Out of range. Are you kidding me? Wow, that is a problem. Yes. Thankfully, anyone who moves around there will immediately get shot. And good news is we do have a doctor, so yes. healing people is not a problem. But fudge. Oh, actually, still can, can hit him. Also, there's a chance of me, of Electron, at least, hitting the guy over there, <laughs> which is hilarious. Wonder how many lives I've got left after that. Good question, Midget, because you yeah. just got pretty lucky. Ah, uh, boy. Okay. Um, uh, what do I want to do? I almost want to sort of retreat uh, Electrovent and replace him with Jam so he can actually shoot those people. That might actually be a good idea. Unfortunately, yeah. Jam is no long, not currently active. Oh, again, good shot. I am uh, restraining from shooting from uh, at a distance that is not yeah, optimal for my weapon. Like, pistols are not effective at this range, but hey, Spider just killed one person outside of the effective range. Okay, more people are coming in. Again. This is definitely that top that part. Okay, two more over here. Oh, please. Oh, yes. darn. Oh, Yasmin just got hit real bad. Okay. Oh, boy. Her aim is now affected. Yes. Well, that, that guy is no longer going to be bothering her. I 
I might want to retreat Yasmin whenever there's a possibility. You got my ear. Unfortunately, I really don't want Ira to stop looking in this direction. Also, uh, okay, four is gonna be enough. Yes. Uh, okay. Again, I suppose I should just be using my pistols after all, because once again, we, we just killed yet another person. Okay, I'm gonna move Jam up. And yeah, Yasmin needs to hide. Yasmin really needs to hide. So Yasmin, we're gonna bring her back. Electron is another person who's hurt. Yasmin does not have a medical kit on her, as far as I know. And her medical skill is very low. I'm gonna do... Actually, Yasmin... Oh, darn, it's too late. Yes. Oh, that's a shame. Okay. We'll figure it out. Ooh, I am... I am taking yes. a pretty big risk, yeah. There are people over there. Yeah. Uh, Spider actually is gonna move up here, I think. Yes. Electrovin, I'll just have you look in there for now. Yes. Uh, Midget, you're aiming. Good. Most importantly, Yasmin has been taken out of the uh, out of the fire, so that's good. Oh, and actually, it's time for a break. This 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 yes. battle has has taken longer than I anticipated. Got a gun jam here. Oh, that is a problem. And the gun is also out of ammo and. Oh, goodness gracious. I completely missed that, but he's actually out of ammo for his gun. Really? Has he used every single one? Oh, seemingly has used every single bit. Thankfully, he can do this. And man, what a good shot he is. Uh, Yasmin is gonna actually crawl over there. Good. Jam's gonna park up over here. Actually, Jam can start looking in that direction. Not shoot just yet, but at the very least. Yes. Yeah. And I'm gonna move Spider over here and start aiming in that direction. I'm using hotkeys for that, by the way. L is for looking in the direction, also taking yeah. aim. Okay, let's have Spider try. Again, she had pretty good luck with, with hitting her shots, even at over optimal distance. Are you kidding me? Number two. Wow. Again. Oh no, a gun jam on a gun jam on Jam's weapon. You are indeed kidding me. Usually you just need to shoot a couple yes. of times to sort of uh, get that jam cleared. No, this is like there's a chance I can hit, but it's pretty low. Also got that guy on the ground, so... Until I reload it. It's harder for me to hit him. Was yes. that as close as it failed? Okay, Jam, can you, can you hit that guy? Oh, no, it's... We found that gun on the battlefield, and as such, we might have an issue with yeah. just... Uh, we're just having a good gun. Need to this. Really? You as well? Oh god, this is too many jams. I mean, this is this is classical jams. Or classic jams. That we're currently playing. But the problem is, I did not expect that many jams. Oh, spider, so close. Yes. I'm considering having a uh, jam just sh uh, get out of the cover, shoot at that guy. I think he can do that. I am ready. Uh, Yasmin. Uh, actually, Yasmin can stand up and get here. I'm risking, you got my ear. but I will do this. Uh, Ira will turn around, get close here, lie down, and start start making. Oh, they both need to sit down. Okay, I just wanted someone to aim in that direction. Yes. I'm gonna move Midget up then. Also, really need to make sure that nobody's in this area. Yes. Uh, unfortunately, I've already lost count as to how many people are everywhere. Okay, that's good. Nighty night. Uh, quick look in there. I really am too too afraid that somebody's gonna come from there. Uh, jam. Jam has a gun. Jam. That's the worst. Jam, come on. He is right there. Like, he is literally right there. Spider needs to finish it. That's it for targets, at least in this area. Oh boy, that voice. Yes, apply first aid to only Electro needs it, thankfully. We fixed. Uh, okay, and now this actually will be a good spot for me to uh, make safe. 
and go on a quick break. As you can see, there was a test game. Oh, I should have actually named that something. Uh, I don't think that's a problem. Anyway, uh, we're going to take another short break, folks. Uh, when I come back, another 50... Oh, boy. Just keeps on doing that. Uh, 50 or so minutes of Jagged Alliance 2. Uh, we should be able to uh, free yet another sector over here. And that should be... That should be enough for one day, I suppose. But yeah, once again, it's a big nostalgia trip from from the characters to voices. Even voices, just voices immediately trigger a lot of a lot of memories. Uh, it's an interesting squad we have here. It's it's cool to actually play with multiple player created characters. And plus all the improvements that have been in. But yeah, enough yak yak. I'll see you in about five minutes.
All right, welcome back to the Fantabulous Jar of Jam and, well, Classic Jams. Yeah, this is a rule called Secondary Commercial Airstrip. Well, let's listen She's to carrying Ira. stuff in and out of here all the time. She's got one of her goons to keep an eye on it, too. Man, I'd love to take him out. If I'm not mistaken, uh, the, the, yeah, the other airport is over there in the capital. So, there are a couple of things I we can... Ready we can do uh do you have oh right this is fantastic uh, yasmin will be able to do a couple of things that i really want to do there are a couple of close things here there and everywhere you got my ear. Uh, let's have irl do i force her to run that sort of drains the energy again npcs here there and everywhere uh, specifically we want to talk to this guy that is a problem i run cargo department at airport you want something you see me. This game has a myriad of, I don't care who is the of accents. I just don't want no more shooting near the airport. That's fair enough, Pablo. Some people just haven't got a clue. Indeed, they don't, Ira. That is very correct. Uh, so yeah, this uh, for at least for the start Nothing. of the game. And actually, I'm not even how sure how it works Nothing. at the end of the game. But I think only in here. We will be receiving the shipments that we'll be uh, we'll be getting. Uh, specifically, there uh, we can buy weapons, ammo, well, equipment, just just basically almost generally anything. I am ready. Um, and it will be the alert here, and I haven't done that just yet, but at some point we'll definitely buy stuff like armor, weapons, ammo, uh, maybe attachments for the weapons, scopes. Okay, this is good. Uh, we just found ammo for. Uh, or a uh, no, midget weapon. I'm gonna grab the money so and immediately put it. Where is it? Here. Yeah. I immediately want to deposit money into the account. Uh, yes, one's gonna continue doing that. I'm you gonna talk to. First of all, uh, Waldo. Waldo. Where's Waldo? Right here. Mechanic. Graduated in '90 from Barlett School of Aviation and Air Conditioner Repair. <laughs> yep, that helicopter works all right, but you killed the pilot. Of course, there was another fella. Can't remember his name. Saw him around here, oh, not a week ago, wearing big waiter boots. It kind of smelled like a swamp. So, so th this is uh... in some kind of trouble. Oh, with Jesus. The army. <laughs> he was sneaking around, making sure. Come on, Waldo. He's probably one of them draft dodger fellas. Get to the point, Waldo. The army could really use another pilot, too. You kind of created an immediate opening. We sort of did. Uh, but yeah, um, since this is a very old school game, well, again, 1999, uh, there isn't like a big old quest, quest, exclamation mark, everything. Uh, and you don't exactly specifically get a uh, direct direction as to where you need to go. But this is um, a hint that there is a pilot that is hiding somewhere in the swamps. And we can actually get him and uh, bring him back to the helicopter. And then for a little bit of cash, he will agree to move our squads around the map. Unfortunately, there are a couple of problems with that. And uh, I suppose I'll, I'll show you. Uh -huh. uh, most importantly... Uh... Oof. Yeah, I can't even show you that. But uh, basically, there are several, I don't think... Oh, God, where was it? It's here somewhere? Unfortunately, I can't show it to you right here. Uh, I do believe all these colored sectors are uh, anti-air sites, SAM sites. And as such, before we actually uh, can fly the helicopter, or at least fly without the risk of it being shot down, um, we need to first capture the SAM site. And there are several, and as such, it sort of allows us to fly in more zones. We can walk into there, no problem whatsoever. But we need, uh, we need a, uh, we need to take him down, uh, so that uh, well, we yes. need to, we need to control the site if we really wanna I am ready. We properly fl fly. Anyway, uh, we need Yasmin. Yasmin right now is our most important person. Uh, first of all, she will open this. Uh, what is it? A oh, first aid kit. Okay, uh, we're gonna give give that to um, Spider, or actually uh, Ira if she doesn't have one. 
Promising. Hmm? In the meantime, Yasmin's gonna just loot every single place over here. All these uh, lockers, all these uh, medical cabinets. Uh, a couple of civilians. I think this specific spot doesn't have anything. Yeah, I'm, I'm not gonna bother so. with that. I'm not gonna bother with that. And here. Just so. There's there's a whole room over there and everything. Uh, so while she's doing that, Ira. Ira does have this. You know what? I think Ira is going to be the one who's going to grab this here I'm medical kit. It. Since she's down there. Yeah, actually, with, with all this looting, uh, let's speed it up. Actually, give me a sec. Am I not clicking in? Wasn't it numlock? Ooh, I might need to look up the uh, the hotkey. Maybe I was pressing the wrong hotkey all along. I am ready. Gas. Okay, that does not interest us. Uh, there's definitely a hotkey to sort of speed up the the flow of time. Basically. Okay, duct tape. That's gonna be important later on. How promising. Okay. Something. In the back of my head sort of tells me that opening this door was a like was a problem like sort of breaking the breaking the uh the trust of these people i suppose uh but i generally cannot remember that uh let's quickly double check okay ira does not have a any armor so i think while well, this still i don't think this will get her any armor at the very least, I can give her the jacket. Thankfully, you don't need to bring all every single character to every single character. They can just do it uh, from a distance. Okay, uh, now it's time for a big old looting spree. Uh, first of all, we can do this. Uh, we can. Uh, oh, I forgot to do that in the previous sector. Again, not a problem. Uh, we'll do that later on. Uh, we can stock and merge items. Uh, we can then... Uh, removal item attachments. We can then eject ammo from all weapons. We can once again stack them. And now we have a big selection of variety of things that we can do. Uh, once again, I'm gonna I'm gonna give some ammo to Ira. She wasn't there. Yeah, like take all. Oh boy, Ira is now swimming in her ammo. Uh, one way or the other, I was going to replace her weapon. Anyway, uh, this is not the best. The revolver is not the best. Uh, she also can get a... Actually, she already has that. Uh, where did she... Oh, there it is. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, I'm good at that. Uh, she already has that. Excuse me. Ooh. That was one big hiccup. Actually, oh, I don't Can't stack them. Oh. Have hiccups with, oh. Uh, the worst kind of hiccups, basically. Uh, oh, darn blood bags. They did something. Anyway, uh, what I was going to do is, since everyone here comes with this. Oh, Ira also comes with the uh, LB gear. Okay, so that's not a problem. We have an extra. Uh, how are we doing on holsters? Uh, she has a revolver holster. Mm, spider doesn't have a second one. Uh, we might alleviate that. Yeah, I think only Spider needs a holster, so we're gonna bring... Uh, actually, it's sort of her pocket I think she's currently using, and it's much more useful. So, actually, not gonna even touch the holster. Uh, Yasmin, since she is our repair lady, I'm gonna take uh, get a duct tape. And I'm gonna consider... Uh, getting some ammo in these magazines. I mean, these guns as well. Whoops. I mean, we can do that, but, um... How do I get away from here? Oh, uh, can I, I don't want to compress time. I want to... Oh, brother. What have I done, and how do I... Okay. Right-click, apparently. Uh, okay. Yeah, uh, right now I'm just trying to uh, figure out the uh, ammo situation and also um, just figure out everything in general. So, we have a couple of pistols. I might want to switch out a couple of the pistols. Uh, unfortunately, none of the people in this sector dropped any um, 
dropped any automatic weapons or just SMGs or anything that is better than pistols, which is a shame. Oh, what can we do? What can we do? So specifically, I think everyone over here... Oh, actually, no. Um, not, not everyone. Not him, even. Uh, majority of people have Beretta, so that is uh, accuracy, damage, and range uh, 0, 25, and 12, respectively. Accuracy 0 means that it's like neutral, I suppose. Uh, and I saw a weapon with 1 in there. Like Ira's uh, .38 special. But yeah, uh, again, we're kind of looking to beat this. So 0, 25, 11. Actually, come back. 0, 25, 12, let's just say that. Uh, most importantly, I think I'm looking for range. Damage can be like plus one point. It really does not matter if I can get that range. 11. 9. No, completely out. 11. 10. 11. 13. Stetchkin is actually pretty good on range. Accuracy suffers. So maybe I wouldn't even bother with that. You know what? As, pr well... Half promising, I suppose, as it was was looking. Um, no, I'm not. I'm actually gonna bother with uh, with uh, getting any of that ammo. Uh, this is actually pretty interesting. Which one was that? I can actually load a couple of these mags into here. Which is pretty good. Actually, I'm gonna grab these mags for jam. Oh darn! Can can handle more. Okay. Uh, so you can reload his gun with these smaller pistol mags. It's still the same ammo, so it's not a problem. Okay, midget. Uh, I swear to God, I saw... Right, it's your ammo. I wish I had the, the, other, the other pistol. Rather, what I was going to say, the... Uh, the actual mags for, for your gun. This will do for now. Unfortunately, the magazines get thrown out. I cannot use the same bigger capacity magazines for him. It sucks, but that's life. Okay. Who else needs a reload? Spider definitely needs a reload. Uh, a couple of these, surprisingly enough, a couple of these are bigger, right? Yeah, 15 rounds. These are pistol mags. Oh, boy. One of them is half empty. Actually, let's bring that half empty out. It, basically, sorry, folks. I'm currently doing inventory management, which is not exciting. I do understand. Uh, dee -dee 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 -dee. Nope, that is a completely wrong one. Am I? Oh, I am. I'm out of these magazines. Okay. I want to make sure that. Oh, Electron also needs one. I want to make sure that everyone has enough ammo in their pistols, in their other kinds of guns. I'm going to give some ammo to this guy. I think we're good. I think we can finally move. Uh, Ira can actually now reload. Uh, there's actually a hotkey for or for a reload. I, I could have actually pressed that one. Uh, I just wanted to make sure that I sort of have the, the idea as to how much everyone has. And yeah, I think we're good. I'm going to leave this stuff here. Maybe at some point we're going to come back to it. We can also sell it from uh, one of these screens. Or I can actually can carry some of that weapon, weapon, weaponry with me. Uh, but I'm not going to do that. At least not for now. And stuff over there just does not interest me that much. Let's go really quickly. I have a new mail. Uh, what's that? Uh, oh, that is personality assessment. Basically, this is not as, not as interesting. This is basically uh, the the copy of your um, character creation report. What's important in this one? Enrico, it has come to my attention that you have obtained information that might help you to strike against my strained wife in the indirect fashion. I hope you will continue to do so. There are several ways to, for you to profit for this, from this development. In order to better identify important targets, you might find the services of RIS uh, worthwhile. I've also contacted a group willing to trade any information you provide for them for classified equipment. You can find an associate of theirs in San Mona. Be careful, though, the black market is none to be trifled with. Be careful, my friend, Enrico Chivaldori. San Mona was... Shut down. San Mona is over there. Uh, we actually might go there by the ways of Cambria. Also want to hit this square specifically. But first, though, before yeah, all of that is ready, we area. need to free dress it. Oh, 
Okay, once again, um... Oh, I wish I could remember how many people there, there were. I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna put Jam here. I'm gonna put Yasmin here as well. I'm gonna put Electivin here. I'm gonna, most importantly, put Midget here as well. Uh, Spider gonna go here, and Ara can go here. Time to take out the trash. I suppose, Electrovin, I suppose. Yes. Um, darn, unfortunately, I can't really see the top of the map that well. Yes. Which is a problem. <laughs> uh, that guy's gun is still jammed, which is an even bigger shame. Okay, let's see what we can do. Oh, man, Midget is... Um, for lack of a better term, killing it. Yes. Okay, uh, what I will do... Ira is gonna come here and uh, go down and aim. Electric yes. is gonna go do the same, Done. although I hope. Actually, ooh, I've, I've done a big mistake. I've, I aimed first and only then ducked. Okay. Yes. I don't think anyone can sneak through here. Uh, okay, the folks yeah. over here. Jam that is gonna is come. Wealthy. Oh, God. Oh, I remember how annoying that voice was. Now it's too late, I've already given that voice to Jam. Oh, I am now very much regretting my choice. You got my ear. Not to you. Uh, Yasmin. Yasmin is going to move Just here. So. At least for as much as he cha she can. Yo, I heard something. Uh, Midget, here's something coming from the south. Yes. Midget is over here, okay. Oof. Uh, you know what? I'm going to turn Midget around. I'm also gonna right. have... Spider can't do much in that direction. I just don't want to miss... Yes. You know what, Electroman? Oh, God. Jesus Christ. Yeah, there will be one person. Okay, so we're gonna bring you down. I'm gonna have you aim. I just want to make yes. sure that Midget does not get flanked from here. If anything, we'll, we'll then spot it. Yes. Spider. I want her to be looking in this direction. Uh, Yasmin, I think she's now ready. We're all good. Jam, how about you just... Can you... There is a... Mm, you can somehow make your characters vault the obstacles in front of them. Or specifically, there's a window right now in front of them. Unfortunately, Jam just insisting on taking the longer route, which I am not sure why he's doing that. Okay, and Midget is getting flanked. Shoot. Okay. Yes. Uh, Midget. You need to turn around. You almost pretty much need to dog down and take aim. Ira. I think she will do the same. I don't think she's in the uh, line yes. of sight. Or line of fire. Electron is going to just move up a bit. Uh, we're gonna keep on moving these characters up front. Uh, where can we put Spider? Here might be good. Okay, she spotted that guy. Not enough action points. Okay, let's go. Okay, that guy sat down. And now a bunch of those people are trying to kill my people. Okay. Yes. Electron? Oh boy, he's good. He also has a silence gun. Man, Electron, you are. Bingo! You're also killing it. Okay. Yes. Uh, gonna take some cover Damn. besides this helicopter. Uh, Jam is gonna just keep on moving on forward. I am ready. I'm gonna do the same with the Asman. Holy. Whoa, 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 No freaking way. Oh, God. Um. Yes. Wow. I did not expect that. I. He's not dead just yet, but. Fudge. I. Let's. I'm gonna save. And I really hope they don't shoot at dead bodies because holy moly. I did yes. not expect this one single bit. Uh, actually, let me let me drop you down. Damn. 
Yeah, I need to be aiming in that direction. He has something automatic. Okay, I'm, I'm at least gonna uh, sort of attract his attention, but... Fudgy, fudgy, fudge. I wasn't expecting to lose a person so early. He's not lost just yet, but... Wow, Electron just got the full brunt of it. I'm gonna save again. Yes. Okay, thank god. Uh... Super. Uh, spider. Spider is now gonna just run like wind to Electra. Yes. Yes. Uh, I'm gonna stand her up. I'm gonna take this med kit and I'm gonna say, just run, run there as fast as possible. Mm, do not get distracted. Actually, oh, wait, what am I doing? Ira is nearby. She will get to Electra faster. Stand up. Run like the wind. No, like. He's right on. Uh, he's right at your feet. Come on. Ira doesn't need first aid, but he does. Oh, God. Oh, something about where he's lying down, I think. Okay, I, I wasted a couple of turns. You got my ear. Yes? Please help Electron. He is. He's on the verge. You got my ear. Nobody else is hurt. Okay, and uh, let's let's not let's not be careless. There are still enemies around, and as such, I need to be very careful. Yes. Oh, oh darn! Uh, I am ready. Russian voices are quieter than the than the English ones, which is also like a slight problem. Uh, let's let's sneak jam in. Oh god, Electra, and I so hope you live. I am ready. And I really need to move well people good. together. So, yeah, but right now we're sort of missing. Uh, Yasmin, jam, yes. midget. Okay, midget is moving up through here. Uh, there's gonna be a person around here somewhere. Definitely, I'm gonna I'm gonna use the the roof most likely uh, okay oh darn there's a problem yeah you know what screw it then I'm just gonna take a look out in that direction yes Electron. oh god he's getting first aid and but I'm, I'm assuming it's gonna take a while he he was one one step away from death and you don't come back from that easily Nobody should be inside. Nobody. Okay, that is not nice. Nobody should be inside. That is a danger to us. At least as far as I know. Okay, there's one. We have some inconveniences to dispose of. Okay, Jam. Take an aim. Take aim and. Oh, I should have. I should have aimed yes. midget here as well. Yes. Uh, is he not gonna move at all? Okay. Firstly, Midget doesn't really have a, a big path. You. And again, I'm not looking that direction now. Which is a shame. I'm gonna move Jam up. I'm gonna... Okay. Jam can actually shoot without penalty. Still can't shoot, but can't shoot without penalty. Yes. Uh, fudge. Oh, how did I like that? I, I need those two people over there. He's now in the open. I'm very sorry. Yes. Electron, please. I, I, don't, I, don't th I think Electron will make it. But the fact is... Yes. It is very bad what has happened to him. Okay, I think Midget is still sort of managing yes. to sneak up on this guy. In the meantime, though, I will continue yeah. jam firing at him because... Uh, first of all, he's training his uh, uh, shooting skill. Yes. Second of all, he has a better yes. chance of hitting. Uh, please tell me you're the last one. Please tell me you're the last one. Enemy. Two. Okay. But the problem is, the moment I start shooting at this guy, oh, 
Oh god, they're coming from the bottom. Yes. I need I need extra people for this. Yasmin is around here. I am ready. Okay, I'm gonna keep on moving Yasmin forward. This is not yes. good. This is not good. This is not good. Okay, unfortunately I've been spotted. Thankfully, I have a good solution for for being spotted, and that is killing other people. Okay, not enough points. Uh, I'm gonna keep on. Did we see another one? I think there was a third one. See, the problem is, I think we're gonna get people from the. Yeah, yeah, we're gonna get people from here. So Yasmin, oh Yasmin, better beware. Electrovent still getting healed. Okay, that is a problem. Yes. Uh, what I want to do is I want to bring Midget to here and have him look in that direction, I think. Because, again, flank is a possibility, but I think everyone's coming from the bottom right now. I am ready. Jam with his jammed gun. Oh, God, this is just, this is just hilarious. I shouldn't be spotted by this point. Yep, I've definitely been spotted. No need for sneak. I'm just gonna move him as close as I can to shooting distance. Still not. Uh, and obviously, m moving him. Ow! Moving him closer to shooting distance means that. Well, that is a problem. Uh, that he's now more susceptible to being hit by other people. Yes. Oh boy. Also, I don't know just how many there are. I can't remember whether this uh, whether this mechanic is actually a part of. Um, a part of uh, vanilla or not? Spider and uh, Spider Electro and we need you. Oh, how we need you? Yes. Um, okay, midget. I'm gonna move midget up. I want to make sure that nobody's flanking him. Please don't hit my guy. Yes. Okay. Oh, uh, his gun's jammed. I forgot. Okay, that is not helping. Yes. This is not helping. I am ready. I'm gonna make sure that Yasmin actually sees where she's going. Ow. Okay. Obviously, Jam? Oh, ready. no, Jam. Jam right now is in the one of the stupidest positions, really. He's very much in the open. Also, he can shoot for whatever reason. I, am ready. I hate that with a passion. Yes. Um, Midget also can make it to the roof, I think, which is could be a pretty good idea. You uh, Iris. Here. Oh, Iris is here still as well. I completely forgot about Ira. I thought Ira was healing uh, Electrin. Yeah, that's that sort of that's that explains why all of, I don't have I don't have enough characters just doing stuff. Okay, Jam might well, might be forced to take some for the team. Comes with the territory. Good, fantastic. Okay. <laughs> Cool, yes. he says. Okay. You got my ear. Come on. Oh, this is again. We're playing on novice difficulty, and this is again the fact that I'm, I have jam like that is crazy, and the game is being pretty forgiving uh, for the fact I that ready. I just have him in the open. I um, but the fact is that Electrovin basically got I am ready. nullified. Was the worst. Okay. Yasmin continues on her march. Nobody still has been spotted over there, so that gives me yes. that gives me a very positive outlook on the situation that we are not gonna die horribly. You got my ear. Uh, not gonna die horribly by the ma uh, by the virtue of more squads coming in, or more people coming ear. in. There's it's still a possibility. Roger. Yes. Okay. Oh, midget, you are. Okay. Uh, give me, give me, give me a prompt, please. Oh, Yasmin, you are. I'm loving your character. Is Elect. Electron. Okay. I'm gonna save. Uh, I'm gonna see if Ira, Ira perhaps can help. I don't think she can. Oh god, is, is this Well, you'll good? find a nice bombed out piece of tarmac here that used to pass no, for the local can't. airstrip. 
Believe it or not, there was a time when people used it for pleasure, before the Queen bombed it, that is. Roger! Okay. Oh, please give me good news. I, th I, th I might need to switch to a slightly different mode of healing for Electvin. But for now, but first, let's do this. Ira will meet... Uh, oh, now she can heal. Fantastic. Ira will meet... I am Father, Father, John, Father John, Walker. John Walker. You may call me Father John. He's also pretty drunk at this point. I haven't seen you around, Ira. I was worried perhaps something had happened to you. You're looking well, as always. He is just a little bit creepy. Miguel Cordona needs my assistance? Well, he does. I think I can put together he some food does. and supplies. Fuel, as Miguel is probably well aware, remains next to impossible to acquire. Yeah, that is not the biggest problem. Time. I do have some things hidden away, but I'll need to call upon the generosity of the faithful. Moving too quickly will only bring us all unnecessary attention. I'll get word to Miguel so when everything so is in order. Okay, fantastic. Uh, uh, what I also want to do is, if I'm not mistaken, jam had on him a beer bottle I'm not sure if it does anything but you can give that beer bottle to uh, to father John Walker and I think he then is better predisposed to you maybe he'll even throw up something extra Didrana does not approve of organized religion she only tolerates me and my congregation because she does not want the attention of outsiders especially the Holy Father Indeed, the group indeed. has a knack for getting in the way of dictators. It's something of a hey, political is. commentary. I seem to have run out of sacramental wine. There's that quote. You wouldn't happen to have any, would you? I mean, uh, any type of alcoholic beverage will do. You're a drunk father. Thankfully, I have just the thing. Well, that's mighty thoughtful of you. A little something to pick up the spirits. Again, I don't think it actually... Oh, and now I think he has, like, the effect on him drunk. Uh, and now I can't even talk to him anymore. Uh, but yeah, it's it sort of gives uh, gives him a little bit of a <laughs> friendlier disposition, but technically we've already I talked to him, so it's not a problem. Okay. Uh, God. Okay, let's, let's continue on moving around here. So first of all, this. This is the... Uh, I'm gonna bring Jammed for this, I suppose, uh, since he's the leader and everything. Uh, he might he might also have better uh, like like persuasion and intimidation tactics. So this is a a um, basically a textile factory, a t-shirts, hats, anything you would want. And all of these are actually immediately marked factory kids. I think Yasmin can actually come to one and sort of chat with them. Just so. Help us, I want to go home. So, what we do, we talk with this lady over here. I'm Doreen, Doreen. Heroes, the factory manager. Sure you are. This is a private company. You have no business being here. You'll find nothing that concerns you or your war. We make baseball caps and sweatshirts for a celebrity-endorsed clothing line. <laughs> also, a fantastic one. Um... Okay, uh, let's be direct again. I understand your concern about the age of the workers. I too was fooled the first time I saw them. They are all a lot older than they look. Uh, it's the exceptional working conditions. Keeps them looking youthful. Uh, I'm not buying it, Doreen. You're right. You are absolutely right. Hey. They're kids. I'll shut the factory down. I never liked this job anyway. She has Mary a... Mary Lynn will have to get her clothing line manufactured Mary Lynn. Else. I never liked that Is that a real life either. celebrity? Thought she was really something because she had her own TV show. I've seen the light. Uh, we'll I be liable, I, I suppose. Thinking before, but you straightened me out, and I'm grateful for it. All right, and actually, a bunch of other, uh, a bunch of folks got in yet another level of experience. We are leveling up fast. I am so yeah, ready. we have solved this little quest immediately. <laughs> Kids will no longer be working there. Promising. Okay, and so Yasmin is gonna How promising. loot a bunch of stuff here. How Fantastic, there's a couple of good stuff, including, including, I have to tell you, uh, a submachine gun. 
an MP5, which is, which unfortunately, I'm sort of saying, ooh, like cool SMGs and everything. Let's see, Spider, uh, sorry, the midget. He has his jammed uh, Owen 45. Actually, on that range is 19. But we go to someone like Jam. Uh, and again, on Pip, uh, on the Pepasha, uh, the range is 19. MP5, the range is 11. And that's the range of our weapons, base, uh, our, our, our pistols, basically. Same damage as well. The accuracy is improved. And I think that is the... Uh, the most important bit, so I'm gonna offload that weapon to someone again. We also have a bunch of other stuff, uh, pretty useful as well. I'm gonna drop money on Jam. Uh, we also have a pretty powerful revolver. I might actually give this to Ira now, since... Uh, where she is? Yeah, since her weapon is 125.10, 0.29.15. I think this is better, so uh, let's drop the ammo here. Oh boy, I'm getting confusing. Oh, I, sh I should be using shift. Uh, maybe there's a better option to do so, uh, but I have not found that. At least I don't know how to do that just yet. I'm gonna unload this as well. We're gonna give her the Red Hawk. It's gonna be her main weapon. We're gonna bring her all the ammo she might possibly need ever. Actually, over here and over here. Really? Oh, okay, fine. Uh, what else do we have? Uh, I think the uh, the most important bit was I need to get uh, that MP5 to someone. So 0 at 25, 11. Let's see again. Again, Stetchkin, I don't really like that much. 0 at 25, 11, no. Zero, mm, for no. Uh, 0 at 24, 12, which might be of interest. I remember someone having a suboptimal pistol. Not 0 0.25.11, I think. Yeah, oh, first of all, 0 0.25.11, no, that's the same. Uh, she has 0 0.25.12, actually, so that's better. Okay, so, yeah, maybe not. And Python has more damage, actually, I'm surprised. That's pretty good. Uh, but we're gonna give... I mean, Midget already has his weapon, so that is not a problem. I think by this point, uh, we need to give it to... What does well Electrum does not is, is not in position right now to get anything. I suppose a spider might get her weapon. So let's get that over there. Uh spider's gonna get this. And also all the ammo for that she can get. Ooh, there's actually a bunch of a bunch of different kind of ammo. Ooh, wow, weird, but yeah, there isn't enough. There isn't that much rather. Okay, not a problem, not a problem. The rest, I think, can sit for now. Uh, I can grab this, though. Where's Jam? Reload like this. Yeah, I haven't consolidated the ammo, and that's why it's doing that. Okay. Good. So I can merge items. Uh, actually, uh, remove and unload. I think, I think it's first, like, remove attachments, remove ammo, then stack. Otherwise, I'm just doing a stupid thing. Uh, yep, I'm gonna grab some more ammo for Jam. Oh boy, so much ammo that he no longer has a spot to put it. Also, these, we I need to grab these as well. Oh god, Jam is gonna be our mule or something. Bam, the region boosters, which would, will come in handy for sure. Okay, um... I think I need to do as I need to set Spider as actually can I set him as anything? I don't want to remove Merc. Come on. Ira. Let's try this. Doctor. I cannot ugh, darn I cannot set I cannot set him as anything. I'll I'll save again. He's not dead. He's for sure not dead. Um Spring game. Uh, safe. Yep. But I do not know how to save him. Uh, usually you can do this. You can you can set, okay, doctor. One of you, uh, one of the mercs is going to be the doctor, and then the other one is going to be the patient. For example, Jam can be the patient. Uh, in this case, this will, this will mean that uh, Ira will be treating Jam and will reduce his, like, half, 
have burned HP. Let's just say that. The same thing we can do with whatever single person. Uh, the problem is Electrovin does not have that option. I can remove the Merc, but that is not what we're looking for. Uh, this actually might be a conundrum for the uh, for the next stream, as I'm going to be figuring that out. Because right now, the problem is, I cannot exactly um, go anywhere. And I'm not sure if actually speeding up time is going to do anything. I'm all done! Uh, stop. I'm not sure what she was doing, though. You know what? I think I'm going to do this then. Uh, while we're doing this, since... Uh, no, I don't want you to be the doctor. No, patient. Okay, let's go jump back to the map. Yeah. Don't tell me. No, Electra is still here. Okay, so. I think she stopped. Darn, I didn't want to do that. Uh, okay, let's see. Maybe now that's. No, still. Remove Merc. Maybe now that she's not. Okay, let's do it again. And Midget. Oh, what do we have? Marksmanship. Okay. And Midget can now be the... Actually, Midget? Oh, no. Yasmin is our uh, fixer. Uh... Midget can train, can be uh, the trainer in Marksmanship. And Spider can be the student in Marksmanship. Are we having some difficulties? It's not supposed to be flashing in... Stop, okay. Not supposed to be flashing like that. Oh, uh, Spider is also not supposed to be student. Did I misclick something? No, ah, uh, fudge, no, 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 uh, cancel. No, uh, rather, train, cancel. Actually, on duty, on duty, on duty. I'm clicking all the wrong things. Uh, so no, so no, then, um, I don't know, what can you practice? <laughs> Uh, actually, uh, Midget, do you have, yeah, I want to select you, uh, he has a gun cleaning kit, okay, so Midget is gonna, gonna do a little bit of gun cleaning, so you're not gonna be that, you're gonna be repair items, Ira, Ira doesn't have a medical kit, oh, she must have used hers, uh, previously, okay, not a problem, not a problem, we have one extra on Spider, so we're gonna bring that to Ira, and bam, all of a sudden everyone can do stuff. I'm finished here. Okay, midget is done, so stop. On duty in squad one. Oh, come on. Yeah. There's one way I know for a fact how I can revive uh, Electroin. It's just that before uh, before I exhaust all the options, I do not want to spoil that or use that. Also, the night is approaching. And also, we might also get hit by an uh, army uh, walking into the city. Uh, dress oh, the weather has now gotten worse. Uh, continue. Okay, the weather has improved. Uh, Jam and uh, Yasmin are not being healed because Ira, the doctor, is currently sleeping. It's very good like that. Okay, Amurda has just been captured. Again, not a problem. Come on, Electron. Electron is getting, getting help. I just really hope it hasn't glitched out. Again, if it has glitched out, I have a method of solving this madness. Jam is regaining uh, done. lost points of wisdom. I think it's I think it's due to the fact that he has now been yet yeah, fully healed. Fantastic. On duty, oh dearie Christ. Um, Yasmin as well? Hey, Yasmin has recovered all her, her stuff as well. Ira, can you train militia? Ira likes sufficient leadership. Oh Christ, I thought you were really good at that. I suppose we're gonna get Jam to do that then, because he is the only one with leadership, really. And we really have to sort of spend our time somehow. Uh, yes. Let's do that. Darn, how do you? How do you? Oh, someone someone might need to train her in that. Uh, I don't know. Spiders. I'm not sure if spiders do anything. That's the thing. 
Okay, Yasmin has grabbed all of that. I'm gonna quickly double check. Maybe there is another building. Understood. Uh, where's Yasmin? Wait a minute, it's not Yasmin who's walking there. I understand. Who, did, who did, did I just send walking there? I just sent our doctor. Okay. Spider, I'm very sorry, but I need you to come back here and administer. Uh, it also might be a problem that the Electroman is like in a very awkward position. And we had some problems actually getting doctor to him. I think the status is correct, so... Oh boy. What I want to do is do some looting. Obviously, it seems like there's nothing to loot in this place. Okay, so I think this will then gonna be it. Uh, we're gonna leave the capturing of the last sector of Drassen, uh, the mine, which will then allow us to uh, earn money. We're gonna leave that for the next stream. I don't think any of these people are important. Uh, I'm not sort of trying to bring them down. Key, darn. So kind. Uh, shiny key. I'm not sure where that actually goes to. Uh, click. Oh, brother. <laughs> what was that? She's still healing. All right, so I'm going to save. Uh, once again, stream game. Yep. I'm going to rewrite that. See, what's, what's the mail that we have? Uh, Enrico Chivaldori is happy that we made contact with with the guy. Anyway. Oh boy, I keep forgetting. Uh, let's jump to this one. Let's actually pop some music on 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 in the background as well. Actually, that's that's the game's gonna play that. So let's let's quick that. Uh, let's put in some music in the background. Do dunk. There we have it. And call it a day. Uh, again, it has been a fantastic trip back to the my nostalgic childhood, or just nostalgic trip back to my childhood. Uh, I've played a lot of Jagged Alliance to uh, when I was younger, and a lot of time was spent. I don't think I've ever properly finished the game, so there's another incentive for me to keep on playing this. Finally, defeat the Adrana once and for all. Uh, it's it's gonna pick up. Definitely, it's gonna pick up later on. With better weapons, uh, with better, or just better equipment overall. Plus, the op opponents will are also going to be pretty interesting to beat. I was not expecting such big, uh, such a big loss to happen so early. And again, Electra and Mike, apologies and condolences. Uh, we definitely can can bring him up, and he's he's not dead yet. It's just that I'm not sure how to bring him back. Uh, I'm gonna, I can quickly look it up. Jagged Alliance to. Uh, I'm not even sure what to look for. Um, like Merc uh, Critical. Um, like Merc uh, Not uh, Death. Um, <laughs> Alright, again, this is something that I really will have to look up uh, in between the streams. So, the next Classic Jam stream is going to be next Friday. Uh, if there will be any changes, you will find that information either on Twitter or on Discord. Links to that are below the stream. On Monday and Tuesday, we'll continue playing the Jam versus the Backlog, and that will be System Shock 2, another pretty old game. Another sequel as well. There's a lot of twos. When I when I looked up a big list for uh, for classic jams, there were a lot of sequels, and most of them were the second game in the series: Tony Hawk Pro Skater 2, Carmageddon 2, um, of course, a Jagged Alliance 2. What else there were two? I need for Speed 2. Yep. So there was a lot of that. Oh, Roller Coaster Tycoon 2, Railroad Tycoon 2. Anyway, plenty of stuff. Uh, but all of that is going to be next week. I uh, don't believe. Yeah, I don't believe there will be any any good time for streams on Saturday or Sunday. Rocket League's on. Ira has promised to stream on the weekend as well, or at least she was hoping that she will be able to stream on the weekend. Uh, but yeah, so it's going to be Monday, Tuesday, and then Friday. So I'm, I would love to see you all then. Uh, let me know if you've enjoyed J Jagged Alliance 2, whether you like to see more of that. 
there's again a plenty more classic games unfortunately the problem is a lot of classic games are pretty pretty mm, iffy when it comes to actually making them work on modern systems on windows 10 Ooh. some of them are just flat out refused to launch at all <laughs> oh what can you do anyway thanks very much for watching i'll see you some other time um again be sure to join our wonderful community be sure to follow whatever if you wish if you don't bye mommy <laughs> and i'll see you then uh stick around as well uh, i'm gonna host some cool person uh go say hello to them haven't decided who that's gonna be we're gonna find out in a moment see ya that's me again and that's not the rice cream <laughs>